All right, we're live. We're live. We already have one person in there. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I might need to get back a little bit. Guys, I just threw out and we already had a hit on the drop on the first rod, but it got it got stuck on the ledge. There you go. See, it's there's a hit. As I threw out that first one, it on on the drop, on the drop, it had a hit, but there's a ledge. Aldo, how, what's going on, buddy? Max, Mr. Kentucky, my, my man, my brother, the one and only Kentucky. Guys, already 14, four thumbs up. Appreciate it, guys. So I just got here. I, I was gonna get all four rods out there, and um, I have this new rod that was given to me. Mr. Doc, thank you so much for coming in. Um, we already had a hit. So this has a fish on. See, it has a fish on there, but it's stuck It's stuck on the ledge. Oh, oh, he's out, he's out, he's out, he's out, he's out. Coming in, coming in, coming in, coming in. It's a little one, it's a little one. A little piece of eel, little fish, little fish. It is coming in. It, it feels really, really small. I don't think it's big at all. Yeah, he's a little dink, but you know what? We're gonna celebrate a little one, guys. The water has to be almost 10 feet down, and I don't want to break this rod. When I cast this rod, it kind of it did a weird sound. Here we go. Fish number one. The only rod that's out there so far landed a fish as soon as I threw it out there. Guys, how's the audio? Audio's okay? Let me know. Thumbs up, please. Little one, we're not gonna even weigh him up. Two, three pounds. Ooh, it's really cold. Um, what's up, guys? Oh, he's shaking. He's shaking. Let's get back in the water. Little one. All right, back in the water. I don't know, two or three pounds. Woo! <sighs> Fine. Okay, I'll just good. Perfect. Uh, on my last live stream, I noticed that we were having a lot of static. And um, I think it's, uh, thank you, Mrs. D. It's because I was using everything on one battery pack and my ring light was causing static. Poppy, what's going on, buddy? All right, let's get the rods out there. Guys, this one had a hit before I started the live stream on the drop. Let's see if it happens again. All catfish tonight, guys. All catfish. Mr. Dockery said, what are you doing with carp? So I'm doing it for Mr. Dockery. Doing it for you, buddy. All right, let me get the face out there, guys. We're already, we're already having a hit, guys. We're already having a hit on this one. Look at that, look at that. Oh boy, it might be stacked with little, little small catfish. Get eel, eel head out there. We're gonna go back with the original eel head. Original old rod, brought it back out. Time for change, time for monster. All right, guys. I appreciate everyone tuning in so quick. Yes, y'all are awesome, guys. All right, let me get EO hit out there.
deep water, guys. We're back in the deep, deep area. Peters Point, Washington, D.C. I don't know. I have a strong feeling we're gonna we're gonna do really good. I'll talk about this rod here in a little bit. Those that don't know about that rod. Mr. Mr. Chad and Mrs. D, I got the reels back on. No more, no more carp fishing baby reels. water guys really really deep water here very deep all right one more one more rod guys one more rod we'll sit down let's do it tonight let's do it time for some big cats Oh, hit, 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 hit. There we go. Baby cats, baby cats. Woo, it's going to be a good night tonight. A lot of small cats out there. I have a strong feeling, but you know what? No problem. No problem. Yeah, he's on there. He's on there. Let me tighten up this one. Yeah, my, my hands. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Here we go. Woo. Oh, he got off. Got off. I think he got off. Lots of little hits. We're taking it, guys. We're taking it. I appreciate all those who already hit the thumbs up. Thank you very much. All right, guys, I have my back to the rods. Everything's hidden here. Whew. Thank you, everyone, for being here. Rex, Kentucky, Chasers, y'all are awesome. Greatly appreciate all the love and support, guys. Thank you very much, Palmetto. I think it would be cool. That the commercial for the street. Whisker Seeker. Was it really Whisker Seeker for you? I didn't know that they advertised. 
that's awesome that's awesome all right guys going over the rods real quick um the first rod was sent to me by ricky ricky creations he'll probably be here later on he's from houston texas um i don't know what the type of rod believe it or not um look, look at that we're having hits already um it, it is wrapped i believe it's it's pronounced eel like 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 the eel we use eel wire um it, it actually lights up uh we already caught one little fish on that one and the other two are b&m silver cat eight footers and we're back with the famous eel head that's where it all started right there whisker seeker nine and a half that's the one that's got usually the the nice big takedowns let me move the camera a little bit this way have bigger better takedowns <clears throat> Thanks guys, I appreciate it. I, I already took care of it for the most part. I think he should be gone. Oh man. Yeah, so as soon as I got here, guys, I threw out one rod. I was like, let me just throw one out. And I was gonna throw all the one before I start the live stream. But man, on the drop, I was still holding it in my hands. Uh, be happy for him since there we go. Look at that. Look at that. Come on. Big, 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 big. That's a baby, baby, come on, baby. Today I have a, it was a big fat eel, so those chunks are pretty big. If it's a small little cat, two to three pounds, I don't think it's gonna fit in its mouth. So I think that's what, what's happening, either a small cat or a gar. A gar's different, a gar pulls it and drops it. I think that's a small cat. D, thank you so much for being here. I do have the, the Akuma, Akuma Avengers back out. Love those reels, I did miss them. <clears throat> See what happens, guys. If he hits one more time, we're going to bring it in. Might be a little cat already on there, just sitting out there. Uh, Kevin's in the house. Thank you, guys. I appreciate all the love and support. Paula. <clears throat> uh, trophies. Thank you so much for coming in. Appreciate the love and support. Thanks for being a, a member. Really, really, really appreciate that. Love it. Whew, man, that was exciting. Small little cat before the show. I mean, I think he was already on there, but it was it got caught up in the ledge. We're in some deep water, and some sometimes that line gets caught up down there. One time, what's going on, buddy? Thanks so much for coming in. Chasers, get in. Ben, ben nerd. Yes, yeah, yeah. If this one hits one more time, we're gonna bring it in. It might be a little cat it's stuck on the hook. We're looking for those big takedowns. Everyone hit that like button. Yeah, if you wouldn't mind. <clears throat> Kick your bass. Thanks so much for coming in. Appreciate that. Whew. How's it going? Oh, Mr. Gadget. Thank you for some, so much for coming in. I don't know. I, for some reason, it just I hadn't seen you in the last couple of streams, but thank you so much. You know, I know we all have lives and we're all busy sometimes. Uh, no, thank you for doing what you I appreciate that. Yes. Yes. Uh, you know, I'm like, golly, I want to go out fishing and I said I want to go out The weather today Thursday and Friday are pretty much all the same Friday's gonna be just a little bit warmer And I was like my wife's like well pick a day whichever one. I was like, you know what? I want to go today because if I get her mad tomorrow then I might not make it so <laughs> I was like I'm going right now <clears throat> It worked out leave me out of that chat Elson is still grumpy at me <laughs> Oh no, you know we always have a good time, Mr. Mr. Dockery. Love you, man. Like, how are you? Yeah. Dockery's awesome. <clears throat> if you're just tuning in, we already had one small one small catfish on rod. Hey Mr. Flo, what's going on? I caught some of your stream. I think it was Saturday night. I think you go live twice on the weekends. I think I caught the one up no, it was Sunday maybe. Anyways, I caught one of your streams. I was on there for a little while. Uh, I don't think you caught anything while I was there. You mentioned you had caught a three pounder, I believe, earlier in the daytime. Two old vets, thank you so much for coming in. <clears throat> Guys, if y'all like bass fishing, check out Mr. Flo. There's a lot of live streaming on his boat. He's fun. What's up? Monster time, I think so. I think we're gonna hook into at least, well, I don't know, 20 is not a, a monster, but I think we're gonna get into a 20, I hope. That's. I'm really hoping. And the thing is, uh, I appreciate absolutely, Mr. Flo. Um, so we're at low tide. So the whole time we're going to be fishing here, the tide's going to be coming in. And 
people ask me, hey, you know what, what's your best time to fish? It's not best time, it's just, if I could prefer it, it it's when the incoming tide. That's just me, and I think we, we, we're gonna catch it just right. Not that we did any better, but I just, I just feel that the water's moving, so. Right now, the water's really, really down. I had to extend my extension pole all the way out to land that little fish. I didn't want to pull him up because this rod was customized by Ricky and he made from a seven and a half, he made it to an eight footer. And when I cast it, when I cast it out there, it kind of did like, it's it. Yeah, I'm not very good with, with prototype rods. So <laughs> I'm kind of, um, I guess I'm jinxed on that end with the prototype. So <clears throat> I appreciate that, Mr. Chad, for doing that. Thank you very much. Yeah, check him out. If you like him, subscribe. He does bass fishing. He's been a big supporter of mine and I try to support him when I can, right back. Uh, I appreciate that. Yes, thank you so much, Chasers. Oh, 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 we're having number three. Number three is doing a little. What is that? That's just a little, little. Di, 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 di. Oh, 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 it's getting ready. It's getting ready. Do it, do it. Do it. Now, a, a, a big size blue is gonna slam it. It, 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 ain't, it ain't doing that. Just in case we need to get red. <clears throat> yeah, I think that's already a small cat. He's already on there. Uh, how's it going, Chunky? It's going awesome. We're here, so having a good time. And this light got really bright on me really quick. All right, guys, let me go check number three. I, I believe that, that he was tapping it too long. I, yeah, yeah, he's a good guy. He really is. He's uh, entertaining, and he just says what's on his mind and doesn't hold back. He's a good guy. Oh, right, here we go. Yeah, that's a small little cat. Let's, let's go get the dink. Let's go get a dink. Man, my body hurts. I don't know why. My body just hurts. Nope, nope, dropped it. Dropped it. No fish. Guys, when you're fishing deep ledges or in the bank when you bring it in bring it in fast don't take your time and reel in slow because you're going to get caught up you're going to get snagged you're going to lose rig these rigs are too expensive to be dropping them just like that so reel in quick all right get it back out there This one was having some taps, I believe. Nope, no fish, no fish. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. No, he got off, got off, got off, got off. Come on, come on, come in, come in, come in, come in. Come in. I'm talking about getting snagged. I don't want to be rigged, tying rigs. It takes too much, too much time. We're golden, we're good, we're good. Jenny, ¿cómo estás, Jenny? Muchas gracias por mirar el canal. Man, what should we do, Mountain Dew, Pepsi, or the Monster? <laughs> How are you? I'm doing fantastic. Estamos rete bien. Very good. <laughs> That's my niece, guys. She's awesome. She's my niece. Man, I, I, I'm, I'm trying to avoid this, but <laughs> you like Elson? Woo! I'll be nonstop for about an hour, and then that's it. I'll crash. <laughs> 
uh, any fish. We had one. Believe it or not, I was going to get all four rods before the stream started. As soon as I threw the first rod out there before the stream, I got a fish on there. got snagged on the ledge. Started the stream, then I got to reel them in. So one fish, one fish. One small one. We didn't, we didn't even weigh them up. Um, very small. Oh, 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 here we go. Man, I'm telling you, we're having all kinds of hits today. It's going to be a good day, I think. Well, at least for small ones. 2.0, I just saw you came in. I didn't read. What's up, man? You're about to go up tonight. Yeah, go for it. Go for it. I've been seeing pe people posting pictures. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Yes, you're awesome. You are absolutely touch. Ah, the guy touched my finger. Oh my! Woo, you're you're amazing, guys. A hundred dollars. That's gonna be there on the whole stream. Yes, I appreciate you, man. Really, really do. Thank you, 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 thank you. Yeah. So I I imagine painting service by Steve. Yeah, that's awesome. So that's what I do. I do painting as well. I appreciate you doing that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Boom! That's the mega boom. They're all booms, but man, just some are slightly bigger than others. That's 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 awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, painted by C. Thank you, bro. That's right. Thank you, bro. That's right. Thank you. Appreciate that. Boom. Oh, there he is. There's the man. Uh, get the fish in while you can. I hear it. The end of the. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. <clears throat> Nice. Wait, wait, let me see here. Your Roz look. I appreciate that. Thank you very much for saying that. Yes. Um, this first one was sent to me and it was customized by Ricky Creations. He'll be in here probably later on. Um, it's wrapped with eel wire. Um, it actually lights up. It has a little switch. Um, but it, I mean, right now it's being it's being hit with fluorescent uh, light. So you really, I mean, it's, if it's in dark, you'll see it. It's, it's awesome. Um, the only thing that when I cast it out because he extended the handle part when I cast out the first time it, it kind of I heard it Maybe it just it just adjusted. Maybe the battery that's in there adjusted. I'm just so I'm being careful now casting uh, Let me see here. I saw a few people black. Thank you so much coming in Cruz uh, Let's see. How's your day? Um, I'm here so it couldn't be any better believe it or not Lynn Lippert Lippert. Yes um, Realistic. Yeah, realistic is awesome. He's amazing much love uh how's your day been can you shout me out uh, a shout out to trapping 35 if that's what your channel name is uh, shout out to you <clears throat> uh trophy trees yeah he's um uh, what is your favorite sport um i i I'll be honest i love playing uh, baseball to actually baseball and, and it's funny watching i won't watch any sport into its playoff seasons to be honest uh, i watch a little bit of the footballs yeah i do a little bit of the cowboys a little bit of the redskins um i don't know how the redskins are like in second place and they're like they're terrible oh oh oh, oh. here we go that's that rod that was sent to me come on that's the one already had a fish let's go Let, let's go boy we got some small little dinkies around here but Get, get, hook up, hook up. All right, man, we have slack line on two rods. Slack line on two rods. Fish on, fish on, fish on. <laughs> Woo, hope we don't get caught up on that ledge again. All right, all right, come on, get out, get out, get out of that ledge. Get out, come on. We got some serious slack line. I think we have a cat on this one too. Yeah, we got a cat on. We got. We might have a double. Woo! This rod's a true medium action. <laughs> got a lot of a lot of bend, a lot of action to it. Love it. I know it looks like a monster. Uh, I'm gonna say maybe five pounds. Maybe five pounds. Sometimes when you they're dinks and they're just kind of you're trolling them around. So I don't know. He's definitely not over over five little one come on 
man, that's gonna be two catfish already. Man, we're we're doing pretty good, I think. Man, I gotta extend the net all the way out, all the way out. Baby, they're getting bigger from two pounds to maybe five pounds. Oh, oh, nice, 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 nice. We're rolling, guys. We're rolling. It's happening. Oh, poor fish. He, he has the burp effect. Check, check out his mouth, guys. Check out his mouth. Isn't that kind of weird? It, look, look at his head. He just looks weird. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Whoa, that's a weird-looking catfish. Man, this looks like he's a cross between something else. <laughs> Clip lip. Yeah, I'm sorry for that. <laughs> just, it just looks weird. Um. All right, back in the water. Yeah, nice. Four or five pounds. Ah, uh, carp. <laughs> carp. Woo! Nice, nice. Man, that prototype's the lucky rod today so far. We're rocking and rolling. All right, guys. I'll just show the rig off just in case there's anyone here who cares. Um, I do paint my no rolls with forest and paint because I have five black lights. That's what illuminates those rods. This is a Whisker Seeker Chub. I had a, a rattle, beat stop, so it doesn't go down. I like I like my uh, my Chub Whisker yeah Whisker Seeker Chub right next to my hook. And um, this is a Whisker Seeker uh, Triple Threat. I mean, those doesn't really matter what you use, but anyways, two fish. Let's get it back out there, guys. Let's get it back out there. We're rolling. We're rolling. We might have another fish on number three. I gotta check number three. Let's go. Oh, I shouldn't stop reeling. See, that's what I talk about. Don't ever stop reeling. I just did what I was, what I was just talking about. That's when you get snagged. Once you start reeling in to rebait or check your bait, don't stop. You're gonna get, you're gonna get caught up. All right. This eel's pretty big. I mean, they might be, too, they, they might want the smaller bait today. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh man, I Brett, <laughs> I really appreciate those hundred dollars, man. That's that's totally amazing. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. All right, turn it down, turn it back down. Woo! Guys, we're almost up to hundred thumbs up. If you wouldn't mind, let's hit let's let's hit hundred for right now, if you wouldn't mind. Get some people in here. 212, thank you so much for coming in and being a member. Pre greatly appreciate that. It's fat ninja. <laughs> Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Oh man. Yeah, with, with 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 action like that, I don't need monsters. That's why I'm debating to drink this. 
Yeah. <sighs> yeah, let's not talk too much about the elections. Yes, I did vote. Absolutely. John Isabel. Oh, thank you so much for being here. Appreciate that. Oh, Creole. I think I saw Creole. Yeah, Creole's here. Thank you so much, Creole. Creole's, Creole's awesome. He was on uh, Catfish Weekly. I didn't see all of it. I need to see some of it. I know that someone showed up towards the end and kind of messed up the show. <clears throat> no, I'm just messing. <laughs> I was giving Dockery a hard time. He's like, oh, you, you ruined the show. Everything was going just perfect. And then, boom, Dockery shows up. Anna, thank you so much. <clears throat> thank you so much for coming in. Yeah, I rec I can I know you, by you then you have your other your other uh, channel, uh, Little Buckets of Sunshine. I like that. It's a tongue twist for me, but I like it. Uh, is it cloudy there? No, we have absolutely no clouds here. No cloud, not a single cloud. It's dark here. Uh, you got that. <laughs> uh, what water do you fish? Can you subscribe. Oh, Washington D.C. Potomac River. Potomac River. Um, it seems like. At least what I've been seeing that the, the bite is starting to pick up a little bit. So <clears throat> we used to catch really nice ones, but we're, we're, we already landed a, about a two pounder and then a five pounder. I didn't weigh them up because um, this net weighs so much. Um, but on the big ones, I'll weigh them up. I gotta look at my scale. I hope I have my scale here. I have my whisker seeker scale. Junky cats, uh, you gotta get too high on. Oh, that'll be nice. Maybe one day in Ohio. Absolutely. Oh, when was the last time you fished the tidal basin? Um, I was just there two weeks ago. Um, and there was literally thousands and thousands and thousands of uh, white perch. And they were just, I put the light and I showed everyone on YouTube. And I was like, oh, what's the chance that they're going to get my bait? Um, I was just there around, around two weeks ago. So I did, I did an hour live stream there and then I came back to here. And I don't remember what. Hey, Combat Carl. Combat Carl was tearing it up. I was watching um, most of your live stream. I think I saw you pull in three, I think it was, last night. I, I'm sure you had way more than that. But, man, like I said, you deleted, man. Why did I get up? I'm like, oh, let me go see what Carl caught. It's like, oh, the video's gone. <laughs> I think you always do the highlights anyways, but that's awesome. Good for you. Combat Carl, guys, right now, plain and simply, he's the king of catfish right now. I mean, I know he doesn't want that title or he doesn't want... But he is. He's 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 tearing it up. He's doing very big well. I'm very happy for him. Happy for you, brother. Uh, uh, yeah, you want monsters. Yeah, then you're in the wrong show because <laughs> we celebrate dinks here. That's just <laughs> we we used to catch monsters, but man, times got rough here. So <laughs> Never know. We might get a, th a thirty. I'm hoping for a twenty tonight. That's I'll be honest. I'm just hoping. Combat who? Yes, like hey, who who's combat Carl? Yeah, <clears throat> guys, th those that don't know this, the chair that I'm sitting on, I always mention this. He bought this chair from me. Oh, oh, booyah, booyah. That was a nice little takedown right there, baby. Let's go. Finish it off, baby. Finish it off. I'm telling you, man. <clears throat> Combat Carl's going to laugh when I bring in that fish. He's like, ah. <clears throat> I appreciate y'all being here. And once again, $100 donation. That's totally amazing. Absolutely love it. What's everyone doing? Oof. I'm sure you'll be on the water again. You're on the water a lot. That's good for you. Like you said, time in the water pays off. All right, guys. Let me just tighten up that line a little bit. Oh. How I managed to I have the whole river and I cross line. Can you imagine doing that? I have literally the whole river and I and I and I and I always cast one on top of another. Oh man. You still there? Let's get it back out there. Let's get it back out there.
All right, I'm coming. I'm coming. Whoo! Uh, tiger, Tiger Muskies in the house. Uh, McDonald's, that what I said, said it right. All right, here we go. <clears throat> Monster time. What does the Palmetto call it? Potomac, Potomac Punch. I don't know, but monster tastes really good. <clears throat> Thank you for the thumbs up. Appreciate that. Oh, guys, you already hit 111 thumbs up. Y'all are awesome. Appreciate that. My service is John. Be safe, guys. Yeah, I appreciate that, Combar. Yeah, you've always mentioned that. You'll probably be on the <clears throat> on the water. Catch a big one for us. Go ahead. Okay. Someone wants to take a photo and he said something else that I don't know what else he said. Whew. Thank you. Yeah, go ahead. I'm on YouTube. You can look me up. It's uh, Chunky Cat Fishing. We're live on YouTube. It's called Chunky Cat Fishing. Chunky Cat. <laughs> you got people all around taking pictures. Okay, thank you. Uh, see you on the water car. Who'd be live? <clears throat> yeah, if you want to see monster catfish. <laughs> I just came in the jet. Are you fishing? Yes, I am fishing from the bank. Yeah, Washington, D.C., Potomac River. Uh, let me show you around a little bit. Are you new? Anyone new? <laughs> <clears throat> Let me show you a little bit. If you didn't once you knew. Alright guys, so here's the setup. This is the Potomac River. This is the actual river side because Potomac it kind of divides into the into the DC tidal basin. Oh here we go. Booyah! Oh! All right, guys, sorry about that. When I do that, the mic faces this way, so you probably don't hear me. Um, this is the Potomac River. There's my, uh, of course, my chair and my wagon. The sign that Ricky Creations, he get, he sent me that sign. Um, and he also sent me rod number one. This is rod number one here. He sent me both of those. That's awesome. Rod number one is the one that's already caught two catfish. Mo, thank you so much for coming in. Appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I love when we watch uh, uh, eelhead rod with the with this light, with this look right here. That reflective tape just bounces back like crazy. I need to go tying up um, rod number two. There we go. There's a setup. That's what holds the wagon is that stake, and it also holds that light. I do have my green light down there so I can net the fish because without that it's almost impossible to net a fish and it's around probably nine feet down I have to extend my pole all the way out so I can net a fish all right guys let me turn this back around 
Just give me a second. Kind of blind. All right, we're set. Oh. Yeah, Mo's awesome. Thanks so much for coming in. Appreciate that. What rods am I using? Okay. So the rod number one was sent to me. The same person, I don't know if you just saw uh, that sign. Um, I don't know what rod it is, but it, it has a wire that actually lights up. Um, it's a medium action. That, that rod already caught two two fish. Uh, number two and three are B&M Silvercat eight foot, eight foot rods. Of course, everything is being, everything's customized. Um, it's painted with fluorescent paint, and then it also has wrapping with high reflective tape. The last rod, which is one of my favorite ones, um, we call it eel head because I always put the eel head, the actual eel, the head of it, that head part. Um, it is a whisker seeker, nine and a half foot, um, nine and a half foot medium heavy action casting rod. Love that rod. I have two more at home. I just wanted to balance it. I'll see how it will look. All right, let me tighten up the number two. I don't like when it's out of order like that. Try to do Oh, 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 oh. Same rod that kid has all the action today. Love the setup. Thank you very much for saying that. Yeah, yeah I, I, I run a deep cycle battery and I run a total of five, um, five black lights to give that, that strong effect of that fluorescent paint from Home Depot. You can buy uh, fluorescent paint from Home Depot, Lowe's, Walmart. Um, this red on rod number two and uh, two and three, it's a red orange from Walmart. Love that color. Um, my least favorite color, it's from um, Home Depot. It's the green, the fluorescent green. Mm -mm. Paul, thank you so much for coming in. Appreciate that, guys. If you have anything, thumbs up. That would be awesome. And once again, man, $100 donation, Super Chat. That's that's amazing. That's, wow. That's a, that's a lot of um, hard work and sweat <laughs> for you to earn that money and then to send it this way. But we'll put it to good use. I promise you. Oh, man. <clears throat> Is it just on um guys is it is the buffering over here it looks crystal clear anyone else buffering anyone else i want to make sure the audio is okay too uh your end i guess that person your your, your end Austin, good to see you well, good to see you too tony appreciate that oh boy hold on hold on um i'm going fishing good good luck tear it up no buffering here yeah good 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 so guys, I hope you don't, hey, um, carping catfish, baits and tricks, I saw you were live. I, sometimes I just sneak in for a little bit, watch a little bit. Guys, if you like carp fishing, he's the master. He does, he tears it up. He goes fishing with his son, and then sometimes he's looking up, he, his wife goes with him too, so. Very, very knowledgeable. He's the guy that asks carp questions. I still listen to Star H is the, oh, no, 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 no. Safe on the road, yeah, Korea, don't, don't text and drive, trust me, don't, don't do it. I do that a lot sometimes. I don't know why it's like when Moe's live. Well, when she used to go live, I don't think she goes live as much. Um, I, I do that. I just like to, to listen sometimes. Do you have the lucky shirt? No, I do not. <laughs> I just brought mine. I brought mine. A chunk of cats fishing. Uh, and then when it gets cold, I have the Whisker Seeker hoodie. We're having a lot of little rod action. A lot, lot of, um, not serious takedowns, but at least enough to keep us a little entertained here. It's always fun to see those rods go down. I want up your shirts, Tommy. Well, here's the thing, Mo, is, is um, real-time catfishing. The, 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 him, he's the one that gives me all my thumbnails. He gave me a new design for my shirt. I just have to load it up on Teesprings, and I don't know why. I'm just so lazy and don't do it because I just don't want to load up in the... In, I, I don't know if it's difficult or not. I tried it, and it just it was a bunch of questions. I was like, uh, I'll do it later. But I appreciate you. It's way different than this one. It's it's a lot different. But thank you so much for wanting to support Chunky Cats. Well, we'll get it up there. 
this lucky shirt tonight. Yeah, it's it's not doing bad. We're having some fun and some action. It's only gonna get better when that tide keeps coming in. <clears throat> you need it like a shirt. Let me see if you Yes, realistic shirt. I mean hands down and believe it or not, I was at home going through my drawers and I was looking for the shirt and I couldn't find it. Then my wife had a basket where she had just folded clothes. I'm like, I didn't see it there and I didn't want to make a big old thing, you know. But I was looking for it, trust me, believe it or not, I was looking for it. I was just drinking some Joe Mama. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that drink is. Ah, uh, chunky. Yeah, that would be awesome. D, that, that, I, I would greatly appreciate it because I have the one that I want to load up. But I appreciate you saying that. Uh, Chucky, what's up, brother? How are you doing? I'm doing fantastic. I'm here with y'all. It doesn't get any better. Just trust me, it does not. Uh, low wind speed, just the way I love it. <clears throat> Woo! It's great. Oh boy, we have a. Uh, Bunch of police officers going by, probably escorting some high ranking official or something. Let's see. Yeah, we will. Hey, Maurice, what's going on? Appreciate you, brother. <clears throat> so, those who are just tuning in, we're having a lot of little action. Uh, we already landed two small ones, one about two pounds. We, I didn't weigh them up, and the other one was about five pounds. Oh, that's awesome. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, maybe since you get $100 super chat, it's out the ledge. <laughs> Woo, she's really hard to to convince. Let me just say that. Let me. <laughs> that would be awesome. That would be amazing. Uh, yes, yes. Everything has eel. Everything has eel. Uh, and the actual eel head is on eel head rod. That's the, the, the original first eel head rod that we started calling eel head. Uh, that's the whisker seeker. I don't know why I got these B&Ms. Now that I'm using for, for catfish, they seem like they just, I'm afraid to, to, to launch them. I'm afraid they're gonna snap. <clears throat> it's just, that's what happened to me four or five years ago. I had one snap on me and it just, it's, it's in my head. I think it's totally fine. Sorry guys. I think it's totally fine. Uh, where can I get my chunky cats? Fishing shirt. We're working on it. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna hopefully have it load up on Teesprings. Hopefully this weekend. Um, D and Mr. Chad said they would help me out, so that would be awesome. That would be awesome. Oh, this one. This one. It's not gonna be like this one, but I do like this one. I like this one. And believe it or not, this was very, very easy for me to create on. Um, what is it? Um, not Vista Print. What's the other shirt company? It doesn't come to mind. That's all they do is just sell shirts, I think. It'll come to mind eventually. I'm a little slow here. Um, but their 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 website was very easy to to work on to flip stuff around and. Uh, thank you. Now I can stop asking that. Oh, Fifty pounds. <laughs> Let's go. Custom ink. Yes, yes. Custom ink. Thank you. Thank you, DZ. Custom me, I like this. Shirt. Yeah, I do like this shirt. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna ask. Um, well, I don't want to ask because he's. They're going through things in his life, and I don't know how in the world he continues sending me my thumbnails. Um, but yeah, I, I I like this shirt, believe it or not. But the one he sent me, it's more like it has like lights and all kinds of stuff going down. He put a lot of work into it. Tim Molina, I'm not sure if I missed. How are you doing today? Yeah, sorry guys. Have I missed you too, Tim? <laughs> now that I'm reading it, guys, if I don't read your name, it's because I'm dyslexic and I just can't. I'm not going to struggle through it too much. Else, then you should autograph that shit. Selling. Woo! Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's uh, a pretty good idea. <clears throat> Check it. What did you catch? Uh, it was on a cut white perch. 
could quite perch a small little piece and believe it or not if you look really close i bring it up really quick on, on the video i have a video and i have very good footage I, I talked about it that my gopro 5 at that time i had so many issues with that gopro um it was a hit or miss if it was going to turn on or not um hey for the philippines welcome for the philippines hey mike chavez um thanks guys i appreciate that more money on it. <laughs> uh cut white perch it was a small little section i think it was not even the head it was not the head um i don't know about that that big and i hold it up yeah <clears throat> if you haven't seen that video uh maybe you have but you didn't see it but i do hold up that perch <clears throat> uh oh <sighs> yeah guys we got to keep it clean here and don't be repetitive you keep just saying hi hi you're gonna be timed out thanks guys uh, Turner what's going on buddy thank you so much for being in uh, is the number one wait wait no just the number one number one has that that eel wire I think it's eel wire it lights up it lights up uh, but right now the fluorescent lights are making it seem you just really can't tell if it's light or not because the fluorescent lights are hitting it but it went to the dark yes um no the other one is just wrapped with high reflective tape high reflective tape and then i have a light source and it bounces right back that's a lot of, a lot of a lot of people who go and try to do high reflective tape on their rods or anything i've seen it on on youtube um and they want to record you need to have your light right next to your camera eye so it, it, it'll bounce right back and it has a beautiful effect that's why when i turn on my, when I turn on the camera, my iPhone on the other camera, um, and I put the stronger light, it looks amazing. I mean, it looks 10 times even better. I have this little light here. Hey, Justin, what's going on, buddy? <clears throat> yeah, Justin's been out here. Um, he's caught a really nice 46 pound, if I remember correctly. He came out, he came out here with Catfish Bill 66 and then Lena. Uh, from um, Whisker Whisker Sticks Stick Bites, I can forget the name. <clears throat> yeah, Justin's awesome. You were going live from the bank quite quite a bit at one time. It seems like several months back. I haven't seen anything lately. Uh, <clears throat> David, what's going on, buddy? I can't wait to come back. Hey, you know what? I think right now it's very close to the prime time. It, I think for one month. Well, people say catfish is year round. It really is, but I, I'm always kind of uh, peeking on fish brain, and people are starting to post these nicer 20, 30 pound fish. So they're they're waking up. They're coming through. Elston, we have another DC YouTuber on Sunday. Really, DC Metro maybe. <clears throat> I mean, that's the only thing that comes to mind. Oh, 2.0, maybe 2.0. That would be awesome. Two Point is awesome. He does very, very nice. It's uh, I forget the whole name. It's Magician Two Point Oh, and he goes live with his wife, and they're just like, they're like a perfect couple, and they're just really entertaining to watch. They kind of feed off each other, kind of like me and my wife. We used to kind of do that, but <laughs> those days are long gone. <clears throat> Y'all are awesome. I'm not sure if he's still here or not. Creole Justin. Uh, good luck. Yeah. Yeah, say hi to everyone. Y'all are awesome. Whew, 127 thumbs up. I appreciate that, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, um, who was live? Um, I don't know if y'all... He's the one that scared me when I was live. Um, fishing Adventures of Catterman. Uh, he was live in uh, Delaware yesterday. And he caught several catfish, believe it or not. He did pretty good. Not bad. Uh, yeah, Mike Chavez is awesome. <laughs> I told Mike Chavez, Mike Chavez, I try to watch some of your videos, but I'm not too much into cooking. He's like, oh, brother, don't worry about it. Come by when you can. But that's just, hey, what's going on, Outdoor Addictions? Uh, we already had two two fish, two, two small catfish. Um, thank you, Poppy, for, for taking care of business. Um, yeah, two small ones, about two pounds and five pounds, so... It's kind of going up double, so next one, I hope it's 10 pounds. <laughs> or anything. Just take... Uh, I uncovered my... Hey, you uncovered your boat? <laughs> wait, wait. 
It's it's when you're supposed to start covering it. That's when you're supposed to what do you call it? Winterize your engine. <laughs> Woo. <clears throat> What is that about? Yeah, thank you. Thank you guys. <clears throat> it's gone. Well, when we first started this the stream, it was like kind of fun and little action, but it's it's coming. It is coming cuz we're going to when I, we started, it was low tide, so this whole time I hope the, the tide, not that it rushes in here, it does not, but I mean, it, the moving water helps out, I think. Yeah, Mike Chavez is awesome. He's, he's, uh, he's been very lucky enough to, to be on uh, Luke from Catfish and Carp on, a, on at least a couple of, video, couple of videos. He was uh, gar fishing once with him, and then uh, he, he had a, like a long interview at the Catfish Conference a couple of years ago. It was, it was a pretty funny, awesome. Luke made it interesting. It was, it was good. Mike Chavez is awesome. Oh, I saw the first one. Oh, you saw the first one? Uh, first catfish, maybe? <laughs> <clears throat> Thank you, Mo. <sighs> Earthlings has made it. Hey, well, welcome to the show. May the trolls be with you. <laughs> yeah, they're here, but you know what? I have awesome moderators. They'll take care, take care of business. They might catch it. Or I'll, I'll x them out. Uh, why call it cut me off in your chats? Uh, uh, just that first one we started the stream, two pounds, and then we caught a five pounder. And then we were having a few hits earlier, about 20 minutes ago, and it just kind of shut down, but. We'll see. Man, how, how time flies, 36, 623. I appreciate everyone being here. Were you planning to go live, Outdoor Addiction, today? Guys, that's another person, Outdoor Addiction. If you like bank fishing, check him out. Check him out. He's uh, he's new to it. I mean, he's been fishing his whole life, but I'm live, live on YouTube. And let me just tell you, he's uh, one of the few people who's getting it right. Him, and I don't think I've seen him yet, uh, S. Uh, S. Smith, which is Stan, he goes live from the bank with the sun. I really enjoy that one. Uh, Chesapeake, good, good lighting, good setup. Of course, y'all know DMV. DMV is awesome. It's not a lot of people that are really picking up on this bank, the, on the bank fishing. I mean, on uh, the bank fishing, you gotta have good light for us, guys. We want to see the rods. I mean, I'm just speaking. I don't know. If, <laughs> I, I think the rods are important. Yeah, realistic is awesome and amazing. Realistic. If you're still here, I was looking for your shirt. I promise you. I promise you. <clears throat> I couldn't find it, but I do apologize. Uh, next time the fish take down. Yeah, take it down right. Yeah, don't no playing around. Any kind of, wait, any kind of fish. Yes, any kind of fish, I guess. Miss it. Yes. Mr. Chad just put outdoor addictions. Hit hit that link, guys. Hit it, subscribe. You won't be disappointed when he goes live. Oh, he does he does other other videos too. Or maybe Mike Turner also did it as well. I appreciate y'all guys, y'all supporting one another. That's awesome. Love it, love it, love it. Oh, so I don't know if I finished talking about. Um, I hope that this this microphone on my last live stream because I went back to watch some of it. It was kind of staticky. Um, I, I brought two different battery sources. One just charging my phone, and the other one charging all kinds of other stuff. I have my ring light. I have an additional small little light i have my light that faces that way uh, but i think the ring light was causing that static so i separated that so we don't have that static i hope that cleaned it up because i mean it, it annoys me and i i, I hope i feel bad that y'all had to kind of put up with it hey scotty hill what's going on buddy scotty hill won one of my giveaways Oof, about three years ago when i had uh i think the 2000 subscriber was it a thousand subscriber he won a whisker seeker rod. <clears throat> Thank you so much for coming. I appreciate that.
<sighs> Let's see here. Hey, Whisker Whisper. Man, I, that's a tongue twister. It's, thank you for so much uh, for coming in. <clears throat> Those who are just coming in, we're up to two catfish. Two small ones. One one right when we started the stream and then a five two pounder and five pounder. Nothing big, but hopefully they're coming around. Good, good, good. So I think I, I don't know. I just thought like, what's going on with it? I, because sometimes I wiggle the wires. I was like, it has to be this ring light that's just it, it's drawing weird voltage. Um, and I'm glad. I think I finally fixed that. Good picture and good audio, kind of helps out. Uh, what's up, Chunky? Good luck from Cal hey, well, California. Thank you so much. Love the show. Thank you so much for saying that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't believe we had a hundred dollar super chip the right, right off the bat boom <laughs> Woo. now we just need these rods to start moving around a little bit i do have a small little eel um live really really small one I, I it's in the bag i don't know if it's still alive but i was thinking about we've tried live eel at least three or four times I think we had it hit one time, and that's when the Coast Guard was right up on us, and I missed it. Missed it. <clears throat> A new reel. You know what? Um, Feller, Feller, Feller um, gave me a three hundred dollar. Uh, super chat to buy Abu Garcia's they've been ordered and boy have they been giving me Abu Garcia I'll be honest I'm really disappointed on the runaround that they've been giving me and and, and I and I call them I said man I feel like I'm being really just like mistreated with y'all telling me they've been they're, they're gonna be shipped out the following week and I wait two more weeks to, to say hey you know what I haven't received them they're like hey you know what they were in stock but they weren't shipped out and I'm like what so that they just Anyways, I said, look, at this point, the only thing I'm gonna set up, they're like, oh, I can send you one pro and one special. And then you'll have to wait for the next, the, one more special later. And I said, no, at this point, you're gonna have to send me three, three pros. They're like, oh, if that's what's gonna make you happy, we'll do that. So I hope that it, it works out that way. Cause that's like an additional $100, $160 in upgrade in a reel. I mean, not, not that we need it. I'm not saying that you need that, but. <clears throat> Let's see here. Can you try chicken? Uh, we, we've done chicken. Chicken works. Chicken does work. Thank you. Um, uh, da, da, da. Let me see here. Uh, yeah, chicken works. I tried chicken with uh, strawberry, strawberry chicken. I think we caught two fish, two or three. And I also tried chicken with, um, I appreciate y'all doing that guys. Thank you. Um, yeah, but we have done the chicken. <clears throat> Sorry, kind of throws me off. These trolls are coming in here like crazy today. Hey man from Indianapolis. Well, welcome. Thank you so much for coming in. Appreciate that. If you're just coming in, we've uh, caught two, two fish. We're working on our third. And for some reason, in the last 20 minutes, the rods haven't done anything. When we first started the show, they were kind of moving around, bouncing. We'll give it another few minutes. And what I could do is maybe. Um, Filet, because I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. What do you call it? flapper? I didn't do flappers today. I get so busy, I want to get out there and search, just start fishing. Best of luck tonight, Kansas. I appreciate that. Appreciate. It. Thank you very much. Welcome to the show. Let me see it. Yeah, to me, eel, eel is the best. I just love eel. That's crazy. Uh, let's see here. Fishing. Here 
Wow. Fishing and gear caught. I, that channel doesn't ring a bell for some reason. Sorry. What is up with the trolls today, guys? Uh, sorry, I had to leave for a little bit. No problem. Welcome back. What's up, Chunky? Well, the rods were dancing and we caught two small ones. Damn, what's with the, yeah, I know. What's with the trolls? Uh, we're ha I'm happy to be here fishing and then the show started really strong caught a two-pounder and a five-pounder and then it just went dead dang hundred dollars yes hundred dollar super chat that's amazing absolutely amazing I'm glad it's up there it's, everyone can see that big super chat appreciate that thank you thank you thank you I seen that I seen him do that also and I can't remember who's who's um, if it was combat Carl's I don't know whose it was and he does it and he just doesn't say very much he just stays silent he watches the show and just but that's awesome second time he does that he doesn't chat a lot that hey you know what sometimes i like to just sit back and enjoy the show i do i have um wait Oh, you have a premiere. That's what you're talking about. So you, that's when you're you're talking. Oh, that's that's all right. Palmetto, do what you got to do. Oh, 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 boy. Let's go. Come on. At least, you know, a, li a little, a little, a little dink hitting it. Uh, what's the water temperature? Uh, I don't know, to be honest. I don't know. I know when I caught the first one, for some reason, it was a lot colder. And it was shivering. Um, so it's cold. <laughs> Not that fish get cold, but anyways. Um, it, it feel cool. Not ice cold, but it, the, the catfish feel cool. Is there like a magic temperature that catfish prefer or fish prefer? I guess that's kind of a, a, a dumb question, I guess, but. Mr. James Dockery. Guys, James Dockery is the one who actually, uh, I mean, I'm the one that said it, but he made it that touched my finger. He's like, Elston, he sent me that shirt. He's the one that sent me the shirt. His, him and his wife created the shirt. Amazing. And I kind of look for that shirt. Now that it's, I'm talking about it, it's like, I haven't seen that shirt. Oh, I'm sure it's in my drawer somewhere. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's so messed up, Mr. Doctor. I'm over here talking about the shirt. I'm like, where is that shirt? <clears throat> uh, whisker 65 or 70. Uh, seems to be good temperature. Yes. Hey, you changed your, your logo picture. That's why I'm having a hard time. Usually I, I catch people. I don't read the name. I just go by the picture. Uh, good evening, everyone. Are you? No, not not, not tonight. Mr. Darker says, "Hey, stick with your catfish." No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna blame it on. I blame everything on Dockery. If I get skunk, oh, it's Dockery's fault. <clears throat> I stole that shirt. <laughs> Woo! You stole the shirt. It's all good. Vanda, if I said that right. I'm sorry if I did him. <clears throat> yeah, I, I just I feel that these catfish are coming through today. So, plus where I'm fishing at today, we have deep water, and then it's flat. In other words, we have a short flat, but it's only like 30 feet. So anything you cast anything over 30 feet, you're you're hitting that ledge, and it's I don't like to baby cast. That's just me. I I, I don't know why. I get told all the time, throw one straight down. I'm, I'm not gonna. I, I want to have fun enjoying that rod band and bringing it in. <clears throat> I can't get no love in you. <laughs> hey, Chesapeake. <clears throat> I was talking about uh, several channels that are bank fishing that, that are doing a pretty good job. Pretty good job. I miss your 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 logo. That other logo, that really bright green, stood out like crazy. But I think you have a, a fish. You're holding a fish there. Nice ice fish. Uh, Carl is the man. Absolutely, Carl. Is he back in here? He was. He said he had bad reception. I think he'll be back later. Uh, I 
need uh, my DC fishing license. Yes, absolutely. It's not expensive, guys. It's only well, it's only fourteen dollars, but it's only to the end of the year. Then you have to renew it. All right, let me let me tie in uh, slack line real quick. Just man, my phone just popping like crazy. <clears throat> all right don't keep saying hi because you're gonna get timed out i see your, you said hi thank you <clears throat> now we have 156 thumbs up i appreciate y'all thank you very much uh is it cold there else then um it's cool it's cool it's in the probably 60s but it's gonna drop to 50 later on i guess i do have a big sweater All right, guys, give me a second. One second. All right, I'm back. I'm back. Maybe. <laughs> oh boy, are we giving Dockery a hard time? Uh oh, we still doing the static now? I hope not. Jenny's back. Woo! Wait. Not understand that question. Recommendation on family friendly fishing spots um around where? where where are you from the area there's a lot of nice areas uh, my wife in dc she prefers to go to um the channel side washington D washington dc the channel so this it's, it's the same water potomac river and believe it or not that's where i've caught most of my bigger fish on that area on the channel side because you have a rail you have a rail dc area you have a channel side so if you look up the the wharf, right across, of course you can't fish on the wharf side. It's a Haynes Point, it's Haynes Point or East Potomac Park. Um, really good because they have that that rail and then it's it's got it's like meshed off with like fence. Good spot. My wife says that she wants to go out fishing Friday. She says no cameras. <laughs> That's what she said, no cameras, because it's gonna be her and Mason. Mason wants to go fishing. Maybe I can sneak on the camera for 30 minutes. We'll see. <laughs> uh, hey, uh, Catfish and Crappie, thank you so much for coming in. Uh, I caught a lot of your your live stream. Was it yesterday? I caught a lot of it, believe it or not. I was there a long time. Long time. Um, Miguel, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. 
Um, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed you being out there. I don't think you caught anything, but you know what? It seemed like you were having a nice time. Absolutely. Static, really? Just a second. Okay, does the static go away when I unplug the charger? Uh, let me see here. The mic has static. Let it do that. Let me just check the connections. All right, so I am I unplug where it's charging the charging port. Um, no, 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 what? No static, no difference. You bumping sometimes uh, causes that. It's still there. Static. All right, let me unplug. Hold on, hold on, just a second. Oh, oh. we have fish on. All right, guys. Hope the static is not terribly bad. Controls, y'all. All right. No, got off. Got off. Got off. All right, guys. If the static is still there, so this is that rod. Oh, you can't see it because I have the light on. Yeah. Um. All right. Hold on, guys. Okay, so the static gone or is it, is it still acting up? I think it was. All right, so let me show you. This is the pole that was sent to me by Ricky Creations. Uh, is it turn on or turn off? There he goes. On, off. So when it's in the black light, you really can't see it, the power. And then he's, it's got a charging indicator how much power I still have left. It has the on and off switch. You can turn it off. Turn it on right here. Then you have the charging port. It's also it's it, it's it's an awesome rod. Uh, he did it. Um, it's awesome. Uh, how many fish tonight? Two, two pounds and five pounds. And we just had a hit on this. And they've all been caught on this rod that was sent to me as a prototype. Uh, he just did it for me, just just for funny kicks. How much was it? It, it was free for me. He sent it to me. Send it to me. I mean, I'm sure it has to have a battery somewhere in here. Um, it used to be um, seven and a half foot, and he had to make it eight foot. I don't know how he did it, but when I cast the first time, I heard like a, a snap. So I'm now when I'm casting, I'm casting up here. I'm not holding it from down here, so. Um, but it's an awesome. What micro rig are you using? Um, it, it's um, it's a forty dollar mic. Hey, ten dollar. Thank you, Robert. Robert James. If I'm saying that right, let me turn the light back on. Is the static still going on, guys, or did it get did it get better? I don't like to. Yes, boom, boom, boom. Thank you. All right, let's get it back out there. There we go. Eel, piece of eel. The static got better. All right, good, 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 good. Oh. Set. We're set. Uh, let me see here. Are you going to cook it? No, I don't cook anything. Everything is. If you're asking me, no, it's cool. Um, no, everything on me is uh, just a little static. So it's 
not better. Oh boy, the static. All right, so let's disconnect the mic. Boom, that should make it go away. Good, yeah. <laughs> Woo! All right, perfect. <laughs> Me and my, I still want to use that that mic, and it just, it's like Paul Beto says that these these phones, these are iPhone uh, 11s, they have good mics, believe it or not, and it, it does really well with the with the wind. Woo! The hundred dollars left. The hundred dollars. Thank you once again, uh, Steve. Uh, someone remember the name? It just left the hundred dollars super chat. Uh, painting service by Steve, if I, if I remember correctly. That was awesome and amazing. Hundred dollars super chat. Ten dollars to Robert James. Y'all are awesome, guys. We're up to hundred ten dollars. Woo! The way is it? <laughs> yeah. Sounds better without the mic. All right. <laughs> All right. I just like the mic because when I go further away, it's it's directional. But no more static because it static drives me nuts when I'm when I go back and hear my own videos. When I go see my own videos, the iPhone. It's so good to pick up the heavy breathing. Oh, it's good to pick up the. <laughs> well, I'm definitely a heavy breather. <laughs> yeah, so you get when you're fat or you're fluffies. <laughs> what part of Texas are you originally? You're San Antonio, San Antonio, Texas. <clears throat> Uh, throw that mic <laughs> in the drink. <clears throat> this is my second mic. I, I first I, <laughs> I first had a twenty dollar mic, and it believe it or not, it, it does really well when it works fine. It's like let me do an upgrade. I think I bought a forty or sixty dollar mic, and I don't know what it is. It's still, just can't get it right. All right, no problem. <clears throat> Oh, uh, no, I hope not. I <laughs> I don't want none of that stuff. <clears throat> uh, yeah, outdoor addiction is awesome. Oh, man. Man, crazy. <clears throat> uh, it did. We'll see. I'm surprised that EO head hasn't done anything. Oh, 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 booyah, booyah, booyah. Let's go. Woo, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. So I have to do a lot of stuff, guys. I gotta, I gotta turn on this light bright so you can see it good. I'm not gonna do that over here. So I, it's all, <laughs> I'm still working on it. Oh, oh, oh. hey. I'm a student, I don't from Georgetown, but okay. I love like, fish. Do you go for catfish? Huh? Are you go for catfish? Yeah, going catfish. Yeah, how do you like, do it? Like, do you like, um, like chicken liver or uh, I use eel. Eel, okay. Yeah, yeah. Live eel? Uh, I have a live eel, but I just cut it up. Okay, yeah, yeah. Eel's the best stuff. Yeah, I'm from New Jersey, so I got like striped bass fishing and stuff like that. But... Yeah, there's some stripers in here too. Like now, probably later. Probably later. No, right now. Right now, really. Yeah. Yeah, because we're like right off Long Island. Like my friends are like 40 pounds there. So okay. Yeah. I'll be done, but yeah, I want to come out. I have like a, like a, kind of like a bass rod. But... Bass, yeah, you can use yeah. that. People come out. We're having hit there. Yo, show? Yeah, yeah, on YouTube. Oh, okay. Yeah, Sorry, that's all right. <laughs> you kind of snuck up on me there. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> you call anything today? What's that? You call anything today? Anything today? Any fish? Two, two, two oh, small ones. Yeah. Five pounds if uh, no, two pounds and five pounds. Nothing big. Yeah. 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 Right, yeah, yeah, no problem. Take care. You can find me live on YouTube. Where? Uh, Chunk. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. That's the channel. <clears throat> Sorry about. <laughs> they keep up right on me. Oh man, oh, that drives me nuts. Young kid, you know, young kid, for college student. I didn't expect it. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> He's a good kid. He really is. But it just. <clears throat> He's watching us. <laughs> Be nice, Ariel. Be nice. Oh, you're not kidding. <laughs> uh, how's it going? Well, it slowed down. So we, we're up to two fish. One right when the stream started. Then about another five minutes later, 
uh, we had a, a five pounder. So two pounds, five pounds. I didn't weigh them up. So let's see here. Your new pro, uh, as you say, proto, I don't know what that. I'm not going to even try it. <clears throat> you're talking about prototypes and what you're, you're saying about me. Hey, P, PD, thank you so much for coming in. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, oh, man, it's that seam rod that's heavy and everything. I, need, I think I need to cast everything to the right. <laughs> <sighs> Mike Chavez is still in the house, man. That's awesome. Relax. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I thought I was going to keep going. Yes, I was going to get really excited. Uh, where are those days? Uh, are you in DC? Yes, I am in DC, Washington, DC. If you look up Peters Point, that's where I'm at. Peters Point, Gar. Uh, Gar, believe it or not, Gar. This is just me, I don't know, I'm not in the water, but Gar hit a lot like a blue catfish. They'll take it and they'll drop it. That, that to me is a small catfish. I'm just saying, I don't know. What, what do I know? I'm, I'm over here. Uh, I am I am coming. Okay, well, don't sneak up on me. And, and if you come, come wear a mask. That's all I'm going to say. <clears throat> I mean, I don't have my mask on, so you got to have yours on. Uh, come on, 50-pounder. You know what? Just 20-pounder, 10-pounder. We're, we're, we're working up. We're working up. I have family in. Ennisburg with the same last name. Ennisburg. Hey. Um. My dad might have family up up, up in Ennisburg, believe it or not. Oh, I, I I didn't we 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 weren't extremely close to my, my my dad's side of the family, but somewhere around there, maybe, maybe, maybe. That's awesome. Last time. Ooh, a 25 pounder. We'll take it. We'll take it. It's cross for you. <laughs> right now I have my legs crossed. <laughs> no. Man, this monster makes me laugh too much. <laughs> What's in here? What, what, <laughs> what do they put in here? <clears throat> we might be related. Hey. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm going to ask my dad. I'll call my dad tomorrow. See I mean, he would mention the Edinburgh. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Uh, but we like that. <laughs> there you go. I think we, someone bring me another one. <laughs> I would never drink two. I won't sleep for two days. Let's do a recast. Ah. If I do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. I gotta make sure I brought my my knife. Since I I was at home and I cut my eels at home. Uh, you live in Texas. What part of Texas do you live in? Yeah, Texas is huge. Big, 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 big state. I was done at DC today. Catch Good. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I know that the fish are, they're biting. They're, uh, wait. I'm sorry. What have you missed? Um, not a whole lot. We just had a little hit five minutes ago, but we're up to, Two, two fish only. Two small, two small dings. Houston. Yeah. Yeah, Houston's not very far from San Antonio. Uh, two hour drive, maybe? Not far at all. All right. They said, uh, let, me, let me at least recast EO Head. At least, let me start with that one. Uh, I am from... Then New Mexico. <clears throat> no, yes. Ah, uh, San Antonio is beautiful. It really is. It really is. Uh, beautiful. It's hot. Hot, 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 hot. They, 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 <laughs> people complain up here that it gets hot and humid because it really does get hot and humid in, up here in, in D.C. area. But it's only for a couple of months. Oh, boy. Texas and all those southern states. I'm sure Louisiana, Florida. Tech. Oh, it's brutal. The river walk. Yeah, the river walk. That's funny how I lived there all my life. Well, I've been here almost 20 years, but uh,
uh, I wouldn't visit the I wouldn't visit the river, uh, river walk. Um, that's funny how we well, now that I go down there, we go visit it now. Six months hot. And mosquitoes. Ah, mosquitoes. Huh? Woo. Oh, 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 let's go. That's a fish. That's, that's, that's. Stay on there, baby. Ah. And this one has the smallest bait out of all of the other ones. Woo. All right, guys. Uh, all right, so this is this is the one that's already caught the two fish. Not that we're celebrating dinks, but you know what? Oh. The middle's gone. Um, it has the smallest, and I think it's got oh, it's got the Whisker Seeker A dot triple threat. It's got the smallest hook out of everything. So, <sighs> touch my finger. Yeah, they're not bending far enough to touch my finger. Uh, let me let me get a, a new piece of bait on there. All right, guys, give me a second. Give me a second. Live baby eel. Should we do it? Should we try it again? something all right so i know it's all dirty but i did flap it open look at that flappy that's gonna get it right here All right, guys, give me a second. I'm gonna bring in eel head. I'm gonna, I'm gonna reposition. I'm also gonna flap it open. Also, There's the eel head doing nothing. It's 
fix it. Let's fix it. Let's fix that. Alright guys, eel head, position, it's flapped, 100% flapped. The flapping head now. Let me see here, did you see that guy behind you? Right now? <laughs> no, not right now. <laughs> Sorry. No, I did that. Alright. You're getting nothing yet. Are you fishing? Is that what you're saying? I forget if you're out fishing. You said so. <laughs> okay, keep up with everyone. Let me bring this down. <sighs> All right. All right. <sighs> Thank you, Mo. Appreciate that. Uh, oh, 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 yes. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. That's a fish. 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 Woo! That's a fish, that's a fish. No monster, no monster, but decent takedown. Decent takedown. Woo! <laughs> nice, nice. Another five pounder, I think. Another five pounder. Let's take it, let's take it. Come on, get out of that ledge. Get out of that ledge. Come on, come on in, baby. like a good five pounder, solid five pounds. Love it, love it.
Number three, baby. Number three. Yes. He's the monster. Another another five pounder. Maybe a little bit more, but oh man, that's awesome. Love it. Love it. Settle down. Settle down. Ah, he almost spined me. I think he got me just a little bit. Damn. Can't get the hook out. Ah, got him out. There we go. There we go. Four or five pounds. Second, about the same size. Not bad. Pull it. That's what I'm saying. These little fish, if it's a four or five pounder, it's going to pull the rod down. Back in the water. Back in the water. Nice one. Nice one. Guys, yeah, nice. All right. Woo! We had slack line. Slack line. I missed it. I missed it. I missed it. The number one hit or just slack line? Number one had a lot of slack line. Thank you, Mo. I think I blocked it. All right, back in the water. Not bad. Three catfish. Three catfish. Small ones, but. fun having fun with dinks that's crazy how we celebrate dinks now oh. is it christina who just came in yes it is thank you so much christina appreciate that mr murillo thank you so much nice yeah yeah, yeah. you know what we used to we we wouldn't even pay attention to those small fish they wouldn't even count anything under five pounds but now <laughs> oh times got tough but we'll take it we will take it uh, he just caught a yeah just literally just uh five minutes ago ten minutes ago just caught a five pounder so we're up to a, a two pounder and two five pounders so 12 pounds approximately <sighs> can't complain too much uh, and he took the rod down pretty pretty nice too give it a nice little tug yes exactly that's what i was saying it's that time of the year right now right now Right now, I feel it in my bones. I, I've been seeing people post pictures and they're, they're starting to, to come through. What's your favorite car making dream come true? Started. 
I think you just kind of slipped out yourself. I, I don't want to slip out names because I can't pronounce names. Uh, my dream car. Uh, a Mustang Cobra. <clears throat> Take a joke. Y'all be nice. Be nice to one another. That's cool. Yes, yes, that's the one that's... Wait, no, no. It's already caught two fish. Yes. Exactly right. I kind of showed it off earlier. It does light up. If you're just tuning in, guys, this rod right here has a wire. I think it's called eel wire. And it lights up. It has a Ford baby. Ah. Yeah, I, I do like Ford. I do. I do. And not, nothing wrong against other manufacturers. I'm not going to even go there right now. I just, I do like Ford. <clears throat> I drive a, an F-150 right now. It's a 2019 Limited F-150. That's a fun truck. Uh, well, I mean, we we like to catch catfish. Carp are a lot of fun. I mean, <laughs> we my last two or three two or three trips, uh, we were catching carp. Carp are a blast, uh, but. Everyone, on, most people on YouTube want to see catfish. Yeah, nice truck. Yeah, I love that truck. Man, that, that thing has an insane power. Lots and lots of power. Uh, all about the Ford. <laughs> oh, you like Ford too. Yeah, I don't know if you know, but I had a 2018 F-150 that was a lemon. <laughs> Ford had to replace it. Uh, I had a bad transmission and then I had my steering. It's all le le electronic steering now. It also went out. Um, I had I have videos on it. Believe it or not, those videos do really well on YouTube. Well, they did at one time. Uh, one of them has over 100,000 views, which kind of makes me 300 bucks. <laughs> Believe it or not. That's kind of what it breaks out to. Uh, yeah, it, I, I would be at a stop sign and they would be stuck on fourth gear. And then you would take off and boom, it would slam you. It, it would do that in the cold. Yeah, that, that those new 10 speeds, believe it or not, they're not 100% perfect. Even my new truck, it's not, that transmission is not perfect. Uh, the new Bronco, it does look pretty nice. You're exactly right. The Bronco, kind of a Jeep theme, I guess. I don't know. It's, it's a pretty good looking one. I have a Honda CRV. It's. Uh, Ah, oh, I get rid of yes. Too many problems. Yeah, at a certain point, you just gotta say, you know what? Get rid of it. Get rid of it. If it's a money pit. Uh, do you catch my? <laughs> no, <laughs> that would be awesome. Uh, I wouldn't even know where to go to go get my maki maki around here. I don't even think that's East Coast. That's probably West Coast. I think. Yeah. Oh, 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 yes, yes, yes. Let's go. Let's go. Number two just had a hit. It's very fun. Yeah, someone said EcoBoost. Yeah, I have the EcoBoost. Um, the, the truck I have, it has the same exact engine as the Ford Raptor, the newer Raptors. Uh, 450 horsepower, insane power. Um, it's got a it's got a v6 people laugh at a v6 yeah i i know <laughs> but the power is unbelievable <clears throat> it has a high output engine <clears throat> oh yes and and the dolphin yeah 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 that's what it's called yeah exactly i know what you're talking about uh muscle truck in america yeah it i'll tell you why it's the most sort because they'll work with you on financing they'll They'll find you, and they'll have these really low interest rates. Um, when when Ford was going to buy back, they said, we'll buy back your Ford that you've had it for a year. We'll give you all your money plus interest, or we'll replace it. And I went to the to the Dodge dealer, because that's when the Rebels came out. And I like the Rebels. It's a good, good-looking truck. Uh, V8, you got that V8 sound. Because my truck, the V6, you'll never get a V8 sound. Plain and simply, you won't. It won't. Um, but they wouldn't work with financing. It's just, I was like, oh, see you later. I had a Muscat 5.0. 
Oh yeah, the Hellcats are unbelievable. I've seen videos on YouTube. Woo! <clears throat> I think those, you step on the gas, you can be on second or third grade, and they say it still burns out and peels out. <clears throat> Cats, blue catfish. Gardens and flatheads. Nice. <clears throat> Nice, nice, nice. All right. Yeah, go ahead. No problem. Um, I have not ever caught a flathead, believe it or not. And there is flatheads. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's just pretty cool. I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah. Get any big ones out of here? Um, not lately, but yes, there are some big ones in here. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Cory holes through there built a making highway of thirty through Ohio. Got it. All right, take care. You too. Uh that is cool. Yeah, on YouTube. <laughs> uh, sorry, guys. Um, uh, oh, so there, there is flatheads in the river, um, but they like to hang out, I mean, just like anything else, by the rocks. And the rocks are, I don't know, two miles up the river. That's where they're at. Uh, DMV, believe it or not, uh, two months ago, he was catching some, some flatheads. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Go, 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 go. Come on. Take it, take it, take it. That's a thing. That's a thing. Oh, oh, oh. That's a one. That's a big, 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 big fish. Big fish. Big fish. Big fish. No, no joke. No joke. No joke. Well over 20 pounds. I'm calling it already. I'm calling it. Big, big fish. Well, <laughs> I'm just saying big fish. I hope you don't disappoint. Come on. Let's go, Austin. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. He's big. He's big. He's big. Very big. I can't even. Oh, oh, oh. Big fish, big. This is the one we've been looking for, guys. The one we've been looking for. Woo! Come on, come on, baby. Let's go. Let's go. That's it. That's it. Get over here. Get over here. I'm gonna say he's over 20. I'm just gonna say it now. He 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 pulled way too hard. He pulled very nice. Wow, he don't want to come in. He's just sitting there. He's sitting there. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Just in case anyone's asking, this is the BNN Silver Cat Rod. $32 Walmart, $32. Of course, it's customized by me. But that's going to be a question of up. Woo, we're not lagging. We're not lagging. Nope, no, we're, we're on. We're on. We're on. We're on. Let's go. Let's go. Guys, you saw it, how I couldn't get the rod over the other ones. I could not. Wow, wow, wow. He's feeling really, really, really good. Oh, 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 <laughs> He's taking life. Look at that, look at that. Woo! He's taking life. Oh, we haven't had a fish fight like this in a long, 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 long time. It's been a long time. Oh man, we on frame. We on frame. <laughs> Yay! There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. Look at that. Look at that. It's got to be over thirty. It's got to be over thirty. I have not had a fish, a catfish, fight like this in a long, long time. Long time. Look at that, look at that. Wow, unbelievable, unbelievable. Oh, 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 L listen, 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 listen. Woo! I 
might be the 40. It might be the 40 we've been looking for. Yay! Guys, I cannot believe I've never had a fish fight like this. Plain and simply, never had a, a fish. I'm just saying it right now. I've never had a fish. I don't know. It, may, it might be. It, it might not even be that big. But I'll be honest. This is the strongest fi fighting fish I've ever fought. Remember, my personal best is 52 pounds. Okay. So. Wow. Wow. Look at that, look at that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wow. Oh man, are we talking? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Woo, he just splashed. He's, he's big. I don't know how big he is, guys. I don't know. Listen to the drag. I just remember I only fish with monofilament 25 pound test line. We, we just this one has slack line, but I'm not going to worry about anything else right now. My 52 pound blue catfish did not fight like this when I caught my four or five years ago. Did not. Did not. Not even my 40 pounder. Nothing has fought like this one has. I have not seen them yet, guys. I have not seen them. looks 40 for, I don't know I think I'm gonna keep this camera angle guys I don't want to just start lagging here unless you want me to turn it around let me see if I can I think we did it oh he's i think he's well over 30 pounds over well oh, no no hundred no hundred he's over 40 he's close oh. I'm so glad Dockery said stop stop going for those carp. Get on those catfish. Get on those catfish off the
Come on, lock it, baby. Lock it. Lock it. Come on. It won't lock in. I'm shaking. It's 52 pounds. It's 52 pounds. It won't lock in. Oh. oh I just, I want to have it official. I want, I, it won't lock in. That's my complaint with, with this scale. Let me see if I can. Oh. Sorry, guys, for huffing and puffing here. I just... Out. Oh, my back is tearing me up. All right, I don't know. I saw 52. That ties my personal best. I know we have the net. I know that. Oh, boy. Man. baby oh 52 pounds oh i know we have the net let's just say 50 pounds oh look at this look at this man we worked so hard we worked so hard we did it whoa oh guys that only means one thing we're gonna be doing a rod giveaway we'll talk about that we'll talk about it here in, in a little bit i said we caught a 50 pound fish i'm giving a rod on the spot so we'll do that here in a few minutes. Just, just relax. Woo! Oh, what a fish. Ah. Ah. Oh. Guys, I can't see the comments. I hope we're not lagging. <sighs> Guys, someone let me know. Was it in frame? Just someone tell me yes or no. Was it in frame? Way to go, awesome. Awesome fish. 50, 50 pounds. Camera froze, not on my end. Not on my end. No, yes, it was on frame. Oh. 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 All right guys, Washington DC, Potomac River. 50 pound blue catfish from the bank from the bank oh my back is tearing me up my bones hurt <laughs> oh oh i'm so happy i'm so happy Do the release guys sorry for huffing and puffing on y'all guys oh we did it we did it. Man, I'm so happy those were, that were here. I'm so happy. Oh, <sighs> oh nice. 
press release. Yeah, we're, it's far. It's about eight feet. Thank you guys. Thank you. I couldn't read the comments. I was. I went ahead on the better, the better cap, the better camera, better end. Oh, I think it worked out that way. I think. Oh, and thank you, John Isabel. Oh, Travis, appreciate that. Oh, we were due for it. We've been working hard. I said the big ones. John Marillo said it's that time of year. There he is. <laughs> Perfect, Chucky. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> the rods are moving. <laughs> They're all bouncing around, guys. Uh, let me just show the setup. Not that it matters, but look at that. Everything, everything's going down. Eel hit, eel hit, eel hit. Every, every single rod is bouncing. Every single rod is... Go down, baby. Go down. Uh oh. Another, another 50. <laughs> awesome. I agree with you. Keep in mind, it's from the bank. <laughs> All right, guys. Those that don't know, I do pay my 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 weights with fluorescent paint because I use a lot of black lights. I use a soft bead on this one. Soft bead to protect the knot. This is the one I've used on several thumbnails. This, uh, it's, it's just, um, what do you call it? Oh, my mic went blank. A spook. It's a glow in the dark spook. I add this high reflective tape to it. Um, I add one rattle. This also rattles. And what hook is this? This, hold on. This is a triple thread, guys. This is a 10 odd triple thread, I, I believe it is. Not the eight odds, it's the 10 odd. Cause uh, the eight odd touches my thumb almost. Um, there's the eel. There's the eel. No flapper, no nothing. Ah, I catch a monster cat. Hey, Tommy Tech. <laughs> yeah, I saw I saw your your video yesterday, and uh, sorry for what's going on with your your mom. I believe it was your grandma. I can't forget. I forget what it is, but y'all are going to take take care of family. Family. Oh, I appreciate that, Robert J. <laughs> yes. Woo! All right, guys. Let's get this back out there, tying some lines out, and we'll go over some little details here. Oh. Man. Um, that was awesome. That was all. We were due for it. Same piece of deal, guys. We'll go right back out there. Nothing changes. This is the B&M Silvercat. Uh, just, yeah, I, do, I appreciate that. B&M Silvercat. Of course, I customize it, guy. It doesn't look like this. $32 rod from Walmart. Handle that fish like a champ. It was a lot of fun. A lot of fun. And these are the two, uh, the, one of the two reels that uh, Mr. Chad and Mrs. D sent to me. Akuma Avenger Bait Runners. Perform like a champ. Love these reels. Move drag. Man, that that was that was amazing. I, I hope I try to give you the best camera views, guys. I hope it worked out. <sighs> Fish on that rod, nice. Thank you, uh, Outdoor Addiction. Appreciate that. <sighs> Maybe another fit. Yes, another <laughs> another. Would you say, fatty? Oh man, we were due for it. We worked really really hard for a big one. That was the silver cat medium 
medium action. Um, is it medium or me um, medium heavy? Uh, hey, Ricky, your rod's already caught two smaller fish, a two pounder and a five pounder. And then we just had another five pounder and then a, a 50 pounder. We just landed a 50 pound fish. Man, hands down, that was the strongest fighting fish I have ever fought. Remember guys, my personal best is 52 pounds, okay? I mean, I know some of y'all have these flathead records in the 60s, 70s, and 80s from the bank. We did it, yes. Oh. Alright guys, let me just tie in some lines up real quick and then... Guys, if you're gonna be here, you gotta keep it clean and not you're gonna be kicked out. No trolls around here. All right, guys, I've always said, I've always said if I ever caught uh, my new personal best or I, at least a 50 pound fish, or I'm gonna count that as a 50 pound, 50, 50 pound fish, uh, I would give a rod away. Now, I'm, I, I'm, I, I'm not gonna say what rod I'm gonna say. It could be a B&M Silver Cat, it could be a, a, a Catfish Ugly Stick rod. It's just whatever I find. Right now, everything is sold out. Um, somewhere around the $40 range if, if, if possible or if you want a gift card I can do that as well whatever whatever the winner wants it's just gonna be a rod I'm not gonna customize it like this hey Todd Taylor oh man that that was crazy crazy amazing I was sick oh I'm sorry to hear that Todd Taylor um, maybe we get more trolls because of that title. Oh, so far, <laughs> you're fired. Oh, I'm glad you're here, Abbott. I'm glad. I was going to ask for you because I want you to be part of this giveaway. <laughs> You've always been here, big supporter. Oh, oh Dan. Oh, 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 here we go. Lucky rod, lucky rod. Let's go. Oh, yeah, that's that's a small kit. Oh, Danny, Danny. <laughs> Dollar per pound. Oh, you guys, we're up to $170 in Super Chat. Now, just boom, mega boom, boom, boom. Woo. Uh, all right, guys. Let, I, I want to do. I want to do the the giveaway um, before eight o'clock because someone else goes live at eight o'clock, and I know some of y'all will leave. And I, I completely understand. Pyro, what's going on? Thank you so much for coming in. All right, guys. So he, here's the rules. I will send you either a gift card or a rod, whatever. Maybe a gift card would probably be easier. You could buy your own um, $40 gift card. Um, yeah, I think we'll do it that way. That way you can buy your own rod. You can get free shipping from Walmart. All right, so here's the rules. Here's the rules. First of all, if you haven't hit the thumbs up, if you want to put a number out, hit the thumbs up. Uh, I'll send you a $40 gift card so you can buy your own rod if you want or your own tackle. <clears throat> um, I'm going to stand up. Uh, don't start picking numbers yet, please. Just listen. This is open to anyone and everyone who's here um, because you're, you're lucky. You, you're here watching. Uh, you're allowed to pick only one number. If you pick two numbers, you're going to be disqualified. When I stand up, when I stand up, I'm sitting down and I say go, okay? Not yet. When I stand up. Um, you're going to pick one number. Whoever's closest without going over will win a $40 gift card. Uh, between 1 and 250. 1 and 250. Only pick one number. Collect everyone. Whoever's closest without going over. Start now. Good luck, guys. Good luck. Good luck. Man, y'all got the... Woo! Celebrated 50. Woo! Can't believe it. All right. I'm going to go take care of business over here.
give it a few more seconds. I hope everyone's caught up to, ch to chat. We're gonna give it five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, stop, stop. Someone put stop, any number that comes in after that stop will not count. I can't see who did stop. The winning number is 77, 77, 77 guys. Whoo, good luck to everyone. <clears throat> if, if I can have a couple of awesome people go back and tell me thank you guys <clears throat> I'm gonna get some verification Josh 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 Pitts uh, Josh let me have a couple of more just 100% Josh 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 all right let me make sure he's still here and he says hey I, I won Hold on, let me just say, say, say something, Josh. That'd be funny. He he gives the numbers. I'll see you later. I, I never win anything. Whoever <clears throat> oh, got that's right. Good luck. Uh, has he said hi or hello or thank you or I won? I haven't seen it yet. Congratulations, dude. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Sweet. Okay. Good for him. Exactly. I, I said, I said, whoever is here when I caught, uh, heck, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Bill of Rights. Thank you. Uh, I have not seen him, but someone already said that he did. Say, say, say something once again, if you wouldn't mind. Josh. Uh, I, I must be missing it if I hear stop by it one more time. Ohio, you're good. <laughs> there he is. There he is. Uh, all right. Well, congratulations. Sweet. Thanks. Okay. So send me send me an email. Uh, chunkycatsfishing at gmail.com. Just the way my YouTube channel is at Gmail. Congratulations. Uh, I do need that. Wait. I do. I need you needed that tonight. All right. <laughs> well, you, you just be patient. I'll get it to you. Thank you, Mr. Chad. Oh, that's awesome. And guys, uh, Danny, once again, you're, you're just way too awesome. I appreciate that. Everyone here is awesome. And thank you for those who are celebrating. Celebrate that big fish with me. Oh, that was just way too awesome. Uh, man. I think most of y'all got to see how that fish was fighting. Oh, boy. I've always said the big fish will swim either to the, to the left or right. I've caught a, uh, my other 52 pound personal best. Now that I think this, I'm just gonna say it tied it up, whatever. Um, it, th that one fought really funny. It came straight in. It, it, it kind of gave me a hard time here when it got to the bank well, four years ago, my other fish. This one fought all the way through. It was just so awesome. Maybe it was the rod that made it fun. That's what I'm telling you guys. The rod, the rod is what makes the fight fun. The rod, medium action or or true medium heavy action just makes it to me it was a blast i really had a, a lot of fun with that and thank you for those who are here to enjoy with me i appreciate that bill of rights he's awesome <sighs> thanks for coming in avid i was worried i was like oh you've been to it's so many of my live streams and you had brought this up you know when <laughs> when you catch that that personal best 50, 50 pound fish i had a giveaway well there it is uh, i didn't miss it i'm glad you were here too outdoor addiction thanks for that message you sent me appreciate that thank you thank you thank you that was amazing oh what fish did i miss what fish catch uh 50 pound 50 pound blue catfish fought awesome i mean i, I think most of y'all could hear that drag going out and i had a hard time it crossed my lines that i couldn't even get over my rod that was it was sweet. That was <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm all slimed up. Oh, Chunky got slimed. Oh, new lucky shirt, baby. <laughs> Yay. <sighs> Taylor, what's going on, buddy? Uh, watching. Okay. <laughs> uh, the it was. It was good. It was a great fight. I <sighs> uh, just went back and watched it. Awesome. I appreciate that, Paul Metal. I. Oh, it was so much fun. 
Ooh. I'm just glad I got to enjoy that fight. I got just, I didn't want that fish to come straight in. It, it didn't, it was to the side, to the sides. Ooh, appealing drag too. What's your, it, it, that ties it up, 52 pounds. It, it looked just like that one, to be honest. I knew it when I saw it, man, that head and that body. I think my other one was a little bit fatter, but this one might've been a little bit longer. Well, the other one was long too, this, it was good fish. Good fish for, for bank fishing. <clears throat> Sweet. Thank you, Elston. See Queen the King. Don't do that. Wait. Oh, oh. Oh, is he, he, he he's here? Is, is that what you're saying? He came in? The kid. Oh, the the, the, the college student from Georgetown, he said he was. If that, that's what you're talking, D. Oh, Chuck, your show is there for now. I appreciate that. Thank you. I appreciate that. It's therapy for me, too. <laughs> Chunky, your show is yeah. Great. Okay, good, good, good. Happy. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy for myself too. Oh, I'm so glad we finally did that that giveaway. I really, and I in, in my mind, I said, you know what? E even if we didn't catch a big fish this year, I was I was still gonna do that giveaway. But I'm just glad we it was done officially that way. <clears throat> Let me see here. What? Uh, it's a 25 pound Ber Berkeley big game um, and I'm so glad that I upgraded because for many many years I've done 20 pound and the only reason I went to 25 pound for two reasons it's more visible for the show so everyone can see the, the slack line and and the second and most important is because we're fishing a ledge and when that fish hits we're rubbing against that ledge and sometimes that line gets frayed up a little bit so 25 pounds I've, I've always said a, a 25 or 30 pound line that has no nicks, you can catch a, any size fish, I think. As long as you have good knots, good line. I had, I had thought of, of, of upgrading to a 30 pound just so it could be more visible, but I think it's visible enough. I, I like to be able to cast far. Oh man, I'm so happy. Amazing. Danny, thanks again, man. You're just too awesome. And the other the other hundred dollar we had a hundred dollar super chat earlier. Um painting with Steve. They, I can't I sorry if I forget it. Someone could rem remind me what it was. Twenty-five yeah, twenty-five solid. Twenty-five is solid. I like no uh do you like <laughs> I love I love mono and I think the opposite of brain. <laughs> That's just me guys. I mean everyone has their preference. I just love monofilament. I love that stretch. I just I love it. Oh, I just went back and watched it. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Ohio. I appreciate that. Yeah, you were you were live a couple of days ago with the buddy. I was watching some of it. Uh, nice catch. I appreciate that. It was unbelievable. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Oh. And make sure the winners, you send me your email because all the winners who won last week, no one sent me an email. The only people who sent me an email are the people who gave the hooks back. So I didn't receive any emails from any of the winners. So no one received their, their hooks. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Is that that same rod? Yeah, it is. That is that same rod. <clears throat> oh boy. <laughs> it, it, that fish, it went the same thing. It just went, it went down, 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 down. It wasn't that. Oh, 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 oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Here we go. Too early. Too early. Oh, I'm so glad I finally figured out this camera, how to adjust this light right away. So I'm not blasting my eyes right now, and then I can quickly just push the button and it gets more visible. I think it's working out. I uh, didn't know I needed to. Oh, I'm not sure why well, you guys yell or Um It was present. <laughs> oh, it was just time. It was time for it. It was time for us, you know, the, the viewers. Oh, it's so much fun. <laughs> Didn't get anything off your lottery ticket? 
did, are you the one that one hooks? You didn't send me it. If that's what you're saying, I didn't receive an email. I forget. If, 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 here's the thing: is sometimes people might think that if if you won in the past and if I have record of your information, trust me, I don't. I speak to Michael Murillo, Michael Murillo every single day, pretty much. I don't even remember his own address. So, <laughs> I, when I need to send something to Michael Murillo, like, hey, what's your address? <laughs> he always laughs at me. <sighs> Thank you. Yeah, I appreciate that. It was an awesome catch. I just had so much fun because he fought. I got to enjoy the fight. That's all I got to say. It was. <sighs> no worries, brother. <laughs> if you still watch your hooks, if you're the winner, send me an email. And maybe you're like, oh, I have too many hooks. I hope you catch a 60. Oh, you know what? I'm very, very. I just really wanted a 20 pounder. And this just went above and beyond. But I appreciate that. Uh, let me know. Um, we're Costco Rich. Oh. Yes, thank you, Danny, for, for being so awesome and amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Come fish this spot. <laughs> you know, I'll be honest. The, these blues are going to be active. And, I, and, and John Murillo, John Murillo says that it's that time of year. And I said, I know it is. I know that this is the time that anywhere in the Potomac River, you get the good bait. You're going you're to get these big fish. I'm so glad I picked today to come fishing. My wife says, this makes... Ooh. You know what? Outdoor addiction. My wife made enchiladas yesterday. Uh, and they were very, very good. I don't think they were green enchiladas, but um, they're, they're good. And they were really good. I had some yesterday, and then I had some leftovers today, and it was they were still as good. Now, here's the thing is that she was making a brisket today and flour tortillas so my, my my wife doesn't make flour tortillas all the time and that's my favorite tortilla and i said i'm going fishing she's like you're gonna go fishing i'm making all this food i'm like i just feel it in my bones my bones hurt so i gotta get out of here uh let me see here so much for dinks i know right finally no more dinks hey uh dc metro what's going on buddy we just landed a 50. a 50. unbelievable unbelievable so it's just amazing Oh. All right, guys, I have slack line on number three. Let me just go tie up line real quick. Oh, man, my bones are popping. Yeah, I need some ibuprofen. Guys, I'm going to show you something pretty cool to anyone who's who has not seen this. <clears throat> this rod was given to me and sent to me by Ricky Creations. He's the one that sent me that really nice glass sign. Let me try off some lights here so y'all can see the true effect of this rod. I'm sure some of you already saw it, but if those who have not, you got to check this out. So the reason you're still seeing those rods because I have five black lights on them and they're painted with fluorescent paint. At least one in well, those two are. The other one is just wrapped with high reflective tape. This one here, check this out when I turn this on, right? 
right there check it out it's wrapped with the uh, eel wire and it has a battery and has whatever else to charge it up to turn it on look at that amazing so you really can't see it what well, it's on because it's it's got all the black lights hitting it but he does amazing work he's the one who made that glass sign i'll show you here, here in a sec see how you can see the tip it's in the, the black light still hitting it beautiful love it i'll show you here hold on let me turn this back on so it has an on and off switch you can turn it on and off and then it's got the little charging port uh ricky wait hey that's yes that's that is you right? ricky creations right there guys if I, I hope i didn't say you danny creations i was calling you danny creations last time um and it's got the indicator here how much battery life is still on here cool rod, amazing rod um the only thing is when i first came out here ricky i cast it and it it it, 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 it did like a little like a, like it's set and i was like oh i hope i didn't break it i've been known to not do really well with prototypes <laughs> um but this one's already caught two fish thank you mo for doing that appreciate that uh i'll show you he sent me this i'm gonna show you um what else he said let me get this back out there Well, I didn't break, guys. I just, <laughs> I'm, I'm afraid of casting this thing too hard. All right, we're good. We're good. All right, guys, let me just show you real quick. Ricky was awesome enough. Of course, I just showed that rod that he sent me. It's the rod number one, this one right here. And then he also sent me this light right here. Check out this. That is amazing work that he sent right there. Love it. He is awesome. I appreciate that, Ricky. You're awesome. This is that thing that that rod already caught two fish. Uh, takedown yeah it was a good takedown wasn't it if you're talking about that that 50 now let me show you what high reflective tape that big rod boom look at that i just turned on the light right below the camera that's why it gives that awesome reflection right back i'm pretty sure i don't fall in though there's the setup anyone who's new to the show i'll show you new new sub ricky there you go guys support ricky he's awesome he creates stuff he's amazing send me that that sign Here's my wagon. Let me show off my wagon real quick. I run a bunch of block lights. I have run uh, three of those bars, two set back there, and then I have another one that sits down here. And that one, believe it or not, faces somewhat upwards to make sure that we have um, that um, fluorescent paint illuminated from all directions. Then that's three of those bars, and I have even this strip here is black light right here. So that's four, and then that other one right where I'm sitting at to make sure that we have that really strong effect. Oh, something's bouncing. Number number one was bouncing a little bit. And then, hey, Tommy Tech, you're still here. I appreciate that, man. Uh, and then I even have blinking lights. Little blinking lights there. There's the wagon. A lot of fluorescent paint. What is that? <sighs> Let me see here. Hey, Chunkin. What your eye might do. Let me see here. Thank you. 
<clears throat> yeah, that would be awesome. All right, so people ask me, what do I use to, to power this? In here, there's a deep cycle battery in there. Um, here's my inverter that I got on Amazon. I believe it's in the description if you want to know. Um, and of course, all my, my wires that runs everything. Uh, just add in Gmail to the name. There you go. Um, if you want to get in contact with Ricky, um, it's his um, YouTube channel name. Just add Gmail. There you go. Just kind of like me. I do the same thing. Step back here. I'm back. Let me see here. I'm back. Let the fish by. Yeah, if you're back, we just landed a 50. I'm not sure if you got to see the 50 pound fish or not. Uh, Brooks. Let me see here. You should paint some lines. So, let me see. King, King. Oh, Brooks, you know what? I did that, believe it or not, on one of my reels. I added high reflective tape, like little dots, to see it when it's spinning around. And it never worked out well. At least I never had the camera shot on it. But you're, you're, that's a good point. That's a very good point. Add like little like little lines so you can see the, the line going out but i'll be honest we don't get that lucky that often with that drag that drag sings like it did today but that is a good point i'll see if i can work on that again i think the high reflective tape will be even better all right guys Man, what a, what a night. I love it. Yeah, for the longest time, I had some reels. And they had like little dots going all the way around the spool. So when that, that when the, I, by mind, when I said, when we ever get a fish and it's taking line, you can see the spool running. You're exactly right. I, I did think of it. And I can show you, on, not, not on these reels, but my older reels. They had all kinds of dots everywhere. Uh, let me see here. What's up from... Las Cruz, La Mexico. Hey, that's from Chris Flores' neighborhood. Thank you so much for coming in. If you just tuned in, we just landed it. We're up to, what is it? Four fish, a biggest of the night, 50 pounds. 50 pound, oh, it was beautiful. Good takedown, good fight. Good fight. When you have time, go back and check it out. It was, it was, just, it was awesome. I was so happy. Got slimed, check it out, slime. What time is it? Eight. Yeah, maybe another couple hours. I don't want to be home too late. <laughs> we conquered what we came for. <sighs> yes, I appreciate that. I guess you hadn't seen it, but it. <sighs> is he? He caught a catfish. catfish seeker. Fifty pounds. Yeah. I mean, I, I, it, the scale never locked. Let me tell you, I love whisker seeker. I love whisker seeker rods. But that scale, for some reason, for me, it doesn't lock up very fast. I'm the type of person that, just to kind of keep the show going, I like the scale to lock in place, to kind of catch, capture the, the you know, the same, it just, it doesn't, it, and it was killing my back. I'm not young and strong anymore. <clears throat> not, not like most of y'all. Take it easy. Uh, awesome, yeah. Great. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> there's so much I need to do. And I have to, well, the camera should already be there. I have to hit this button right here. This is what I want to do. So y'all can see it. That's uh, too right. This is just good enough for right now, I guess. I guess I could do one more. Eh. Hey, Norm. Uh, YouTube never told me. Oh, boy, you missed the giveaway. You missed the big fish in the giveaway. I've always said if I ever caught a 50 or bigger, I would do a rod giveaway, but since rods are so hard to find on uh, on the internet right now, I just said someone won a forty dollar gift card. But go back and see the fish <laughs> when you have time. Oh, that fish was yes, it was. It was good. It was good. Beautiful fish. Thanks, DC. Thank you, man. Yeah, DC had told me of another spot that's doing pretty well too. Um, I forget what it's called. <laughs> just uh, do you ever? go for sheephead fishing um not really when i used to go to the coast 
by the rocks, but no, 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 whatever, whatever will hit. I mean, there's no sheep head here. Uh, just washed it out. <laughs> Good. Uh, look like a bite is on. Yeah, yeah, we have a little bite. We have a little hit. Um, number two has slack line. I'll tighten it up. Like I said, guys, if, it, if it's a, at least a four or five pound blue catfish, it's going to take these rods down to a bot right here. I mean, it's just these little tugs like that, small fish. <clears throat> but that that big that big 50, 50 pound uh, catfish, it was an interesting. It just took it down, 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 just kept going down. Oh, it was awesome. Oh. Hey, Chris. Yeah, I use, um, yeah, great rod. Chris, Chris, Chris's rods are phenomenal rods. Let me just say that. Very, 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 very strong fit, uh, strong rods. They are. Hands down, they're great rods. Very, very well built. Um, I'm just more of a, of a medium action and he's coming out with the medium action rod, so. <sighs> Plus for the show, it helps the show when you have that rod bending down. I mean, I, that's how my mind thinks. If I, if I wanna see someone uh, if I'm gonna watch you so much, I want to see that rod. I want to see that rod down, down, down. I think it, I think it makes for a slightly better show. I think, just, just how, just my opinion. Uh, no, God, just for joking, yes. <laughs> no, I'm not strong. I, I, I had said that today. My bones are hurting. My back hurts, and <laughs> I was holding up that fish, and I was shaking like that. Well, I mean, you have a lot going on, okay? <laughs> Ooh. Do, you, do I like oh yes you talking about black drum oh yeah <laughs> and that's exactly how a black drum well a, a, here's the thing a black drum will hit not that I've ever caught a flathead I've only seen flatheads when they say that the rod tip is just kind of plain 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 a black drum does the same thing same thing plays your tip 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 but a black drum after maybe a couple of minutes your rod will start going down 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 and that's when you get up and bam and it's on it's on Thank you, DC. Appreciate that. Pyro. Guys, everyone who's a member, I really appreciate you, those of you who who decided to, to sign up for a month and try it out. Thank you very much. How much? Uh, let me see here. How much? Wait. How much does your net? How much does my net weigh? Um, DC, to be honest, we've waited a couple of times. One time it was a little bit over four, and the other time was was um, a little, uh, under four. So I, I don't know. <clears throat> oh, that's what I'm doing with all the super chats. Well, besides sending that gift card <laughs> that we, someone won, I just ordered a, a, a sling, a, a fish sling, and boys, did I have a hard time. I'll be honest, I didn't want a carp sling, but that's what I end up getting, just so we can get a better weight. And I even thought of doing what a DMV, DMV does, go get an IKEA bag. He's he's smart, he's genius. I mean, go and get an IKEA bag. I don't know what they cost there, maybe ninety nine cents because they're very strong. Um, but I got a carp sling just so you know, I it, we can weigh the fish and be uh, send you this, that. Thank you. Well. <laughs> I appreciate that Net, uh, yeah, yeah, exactly 3.75. Yeah, you're exactly right. Thank you so much for for putting that I think you're exactly right. I don't think it weighs over four, but whatever uh, Black light frame not sure what that is um, I'm just glad that that the handle because it's a painter's handle and I've already had a, a 30 pound a roughly 30 pound fish break my handle but I, this one held up well <clears throat> I got it up got it up it was heavy I was having a hard time lifting 50 pounds like this with the bad back <laughs> yeah. man I'm so happy Wait. Yes, I was due. Yes. <laughs> You're exactly right. We we're due. We we're due. I was like, man, there's a lot of people who watch the stream, and I mean, we're, we're due for it. Then I'm so glad. Thank you. Thank you for saying that. Uh, how you doing, Chunky? What did I miss? A 50 pound blue catfish. Oh, man. Here's, here's why I'm so excited. I mean, besides catching a big fish and showing it off to the camera and from the bank, but the way it fought and I don't know, um, the rods have a lot to do with it. You, you have a fun rod <laughs> and I'll be honest, that rod, the b &M, every time I cast it out, I'm afraid it's going to snap. I don't think it will, 
but it did the job. It did it, and I'm so happy. <clears throat> uh, have you had back? I have not. I have not. I had a, you know, what are they? What is it called? The MRI or the CAT scan? Which is the one that has the images? I forget the difference. Well, I've, I've had the one that shows all the images, and they shows my back is in, in really bad shape. I have five areas, and they're like, oh no, Austin. The doctor says I, I would not even do. Is it called fusions? Five fusions? She says you, you would you would be in you would end up being worse. Oh oh oh, 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 booyah, booyah, booyah. Oh, come on, baby fish. <laughs> now we're complaining about little hits now. Let me check that rod. That, that one had a hit. It might have a little fish on there. Just a second. No fish, no fish, no fish. I'm sorry, say that again. Is it okay if I have a sit witness? You want to sit? Yeah. Yeah, a little bit that way. Thank you. Yeah. Homeless, homeless person going to sleep on the side over there. All right, guys, I took that section off and I'm gonna put another piece of eel just because I have it. All right, guys, I'm back, I'm back. <sighs> uh, I need to be, uh, sorry. On, hold on, let me turn the light back down. Guys, do y'all like, well, that when I go and, and turn the light up so y'all can see a little bit better for the rods, I think it, it helps out, I think. Let me see here, what are y'all saying? Sorry, I was gone because I had to see the video. <laughs> yes, I do that the same thing when someone, uh, I thought Combat Crawl was going to snap throughout last night. He was... Yes, that current was moving. That current was moving fast. I don't know how he could fish with that. I mean, uh, he caught, I don't know if he caught like a, like a 15, 20 pounder and just the way it was bringing him in, it looked like it was well bigger, but you're bringing the fish in and that current. He's really lucky. He's been he's been doing really really well, catching some big big fish. Does your oh wait? Does your wife know you caught that? Oh, um, I don't know. Sometimes she'll come in, 
She will not. She rarely ever says hi or hello, but she'll tell me she's awesome. <clears throat> she watches. Oh, she's studying right now. She has. She's taking college courses, so night school. Uh, have you ever tried night crawlers? You know what? I have not, Brooks. I have not. Um, maybe I should just just for kicks. Um, kind of what? Uh, who was it? Um, River Certified Spencer. Um, it just I like that thumbnail where he has all those those worms night crawlers on him. <clears throat> Good. <clears throat> yeah, my, my my worms are eels. <laughs> That's what we use. Eel worms. They're this big. <laughs> About that fat. The eels that I have. And like I said, guys, the eels, they I buy them. I love the show. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Uh, they stay alive a long time. Um, I have not had a single one die. Uh, I have them in an outdoor. Fr oh, it, it's a fridge. It's a refrigerator. It's a small little fridge, but I have it outside. Um, I'm in a little home, and I have an aerator going to it and keep them aerated. Keep them really, really cold. They, they're happy in there. Very, very happy, those eels. Oh, until I bring them out of here. <laughs> the happiness is done. Uh, cat. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yes, let's go. Let's go. All right, slack line, slack line. Let's go, let's go. Oh, on it. <clears throat> Man, I'm surprised Eelhead hasn't had anything besides a little tap way earlier in the show. Hello everyone, if you're just coming in, we landed a 50 pound fish earlier. Uh, checking, any luck, 2.0, woo! 50 pounds, 50 pounds, no joke. Oh man, oh we just, Big old either snakehead or carp jumped up. Do, do snakeheads jump or not? That probably carp. Um, 50 pound blue catfish, uh, 2.0. Beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and it fought like a beast. And I and I and I was calling. I was like, I have never had a fish fight the way this one fight. As it was coming in, I was like, so I was getting really excited because I kind of already have a feeling what you know the 20 pounder, a, a 10 pounder, a five pounder. But I can remember my 40 pounder and my 50 pounder, and I knew it. I knew this one was fighting <clears throat> just as good or way better. Well, no, way better. Uh, magic man, you gotta go back. Yeah, see the fight. They will. <laughs> yes. I hate that. I, no, go back. Just go back. You can see it. Oh, man. Unbelievable. <clears throat> I was, uh, I texted Michael Murillo today and I was like, hey, my wife says that I can go fishing either today, you know, today, Thursday or Friday. She says, just pick a day. And I, and I told Michael Murillo, I was like, I, I better go today because if I get her upset, <laughs> that's going to ruin the other two days. So go right now. Go where you can, buddy. Um, let me see. Where was it hooked? Oh, right in the corner. Right in the corner in the mouth. And then as soon as I kind of just let so in other words it didn't go it didn't penetrate it was just in there it was in there so if i would have gave it a lot of slack line if it would have shaken he probably would have sh shaken off uh go backwards one hour from here <laughs> there you go my cat's a tie in time stamp checking it <laughs> oh man i'm so happy it fought well oh love it love it kaboom well, get well, Pete. Someone's sick. Uh, where's the hook? Oh, let me see here. I'm sorry. Um, I'm in the hospital and watching your video tonight is really helping me. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, um, I'm sorry, whatever you're going through, but I'm, I'm glad you're here watching the show. And if if you missed that 50 pounder, go back and I'll put a big smile on your face. <laughs> it did for me. Uh, coming to you. I, thank you. 
thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Get well, yes. Yeah, get well, get well. Uh, Wanda Chunky today. It took it. So in other words, you lost the fish or you, you, the eel I had on my line fished. and your float. Oh boy. <laughs> Must have been a good one then. I think, I think you're saying that you, that you lost it. I think, oh, oh, oh what did I do? Um, the hook hand. Oh, wait, see here, the hook hand. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I forget what hook I told, uh, it was, a. Uh, I think it looked like it was a Whisker Seeker triple threat uh, 10 odd. I think I, I think it is. Uh, hey Chunky, be careful with your. Yeah, I know. That's the thing about it. Yeah. <laughs> All I have <laughs> is in my pocket is my pepper spray, and it's usually attached to my keys. And I just got it. I mean, he's a you know, he's a homeless person, and he's he seems innocent, but <clears throat> he's about 25 yards away from me. He's just chilling out. <clears throat> Come on, fishy, let's go. <clears throat> and earlier, someone said reposition or whatever, and I did, and th those two I left alone. I'm kind of glad that I didn't mess with them. I mean, reposition, it's worked out in the past, so... <clears throat> I think I repositioned. I flapped this one and the other one, but these two I left alone. I think and it worked out. That big monster came through. Oh, I knew! I knew these big ones were coming through. Now they're gonna be coming around. I, I people, but I'm I'm so concentrated on 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 this. By the time people are up, they're up on me, because everything is darker. <clears throat> yeah, just. <kidding. sighs> oh man, I'm so happy, so so happy. Got to run. Um, yes. Thank you. Good night. Um, thank you, Mr. Merle, for coming. I appreciate that. Thanks for all the love and support. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me see here. Yeah. I appreciate that. It was worth it. I was, oh man, we worked so hard. We, we, did, we did a lot of fishing trips. Uh, I can't remember if it's been about four years or maybe five years since that other one that we've caught that. He was right up on me, right in the back. I don't know if y'all saw that or not, but he was right there. <clears throat> big rod, big rod, big rod, big rod, big rod. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'd have to sit on this <laughs> yeah yeah if i don't feel comfortable i'm just gonna pack it up i think we, we did what we had to do uh that's okay i know i know i don't know if you saw if you go back how i just jumped up and he was like he was checking out the wagon i don't know if he was looking in the wagon or not but it's uh need a guard <laughs> Woo, let me go tighten up that line real quick
Oh. We'll switch it up a little bit. <laughs> yeah, at least now I think I can see people approaching me. <clears throat> Then I, I put my um, my light that I normally have on this side facing my tackle box. I put it on that side to kind of illuminate on that side a little bit. Sorry, guys, for. <laughs> Yeah, no, no back to the rods right now. I don't feel comfortable. Uh, we need to get... Uh, yeah. <clears throat> He's just back over there chilling, I think drinking a beer. Hey, Poppy, I'm not sure if you've been in and out. Let me see here. You need... Yes. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you know what? There's just so much, so many cars passing through here. We're good. I think we're, we're all right. Now I can at least see people because people come up right next to me. They're like, hey, can I take a picture? By the time they say that, they're literally five, ten feet away from me. Well, ten feet away from me. I'm gonna pack it up. This guy's talking to himself. Yeah, I will. All right, guys, I'm going to start packing it up. I don't feel comfortable here. I'll leave the real nice bright light just to make sure.
<clears throat> oh, it's bright. Yeah, I appreciate that. I'm just gonna walk with me <laughs> until I just get up to the, uh, the path here. Just, I'm just checking, make sure I got all my stuff out. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, as soon as I get to that concrete, about 50 yards away, I'm, I'm gonna be perfectly fine. But let's get out of here real quick. All right, time to go. And we're walking. <laughs> oh boy. I don't like to be like that, feel uncomfortable. I do not. All right guys, so this is Peter's Point. This is where we're at. Oh, I'm not gonna read comments right now. <laughs> I can barely breathe it. Walk this big old heavy wagon. This see if we don't see anyone wipe out. I'm out of breath. Hey, DMB. Oh, we caught a 50 today. 50 pound blue catfish. Oh, Mother. Can't breathe. Let me show you this shot here. Oh, I'm out of breath. We're good. <laughs> Just paranoid at this point now. Check out the monument. You should get a dog. Oh, we got the cops here. <laughs> oh. Great show. Thank you. Oh, big, big fish. Oh, let me see here. Oh, it's the head of creeper. Oh, no. <laughs> Yeah, no, we're good. At this point, we're good. A lot of tra traffic here. We're good. I'm gonna sign off here in a second. I'm perfectly fine here. <sighs> nice 52. I appreciate that. Had a lot of fun. <sighs> here we go. That's it. Ricky Krish, thank you for much for, for doing it, Ricky. <sighs> all right, guys. I am going to sign off. I'm fine here. I mean, look at all the traffic that's continuously coming through here. No problem. <sighs> Have a good night, be safe. Yeah, I'm fine here. Thanks, guys. I, I greatly appreciate what, yeah, he's, yes, he was. He was drinking. He was. And you know what? I'm not saying that he has that illness, but I have a brother who's a uh, schizophrenic and um, let me just say I, I, I know what they're capable of I'm, I'm not saying that he has that maybe he's just drunk or just you know whatever but I, I know what what that illness is about and yeah all right guys anyways good night good night Arco Arco thank you yeah it was awesome Mike Chavez you've been here the whole night Woo! amazing be safe. Yeah, I'm good here. Uh, trust me, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm perfectly fine here. This, I'll light up all the trucks, <laughs> all the lights on the truck here. All right, guys. I really appreciate every single one. Of, I love every single one of. Thank you so much for being with me. Uh, to seeing that big, big 50-pound fish. We're due for it. We had a lot of fun. Good night, and we'll probably see you until next week. Take care.